Katie, if you would be so kind as to set both the W and L commands to moderators only now, that would be great. Oh, we literally talked about it before the stream, actually right after the stream ended, and I was like, we'll see how it looks next stream. And you all just couldn't help yourselves. And you all just couldn't help yourselves even for 30 fucking seconds. You just can't fucking help yourself. Tomato, you know very well the mods will only do L's. Katie just gave me a W. I trust my mods. Hang on, I need to go into your fucking chat log. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Why do I feel like you're the kind of person who only gave me L's? You must spelled my name as Toanto. Wait! Oh no, they gave me a one W. Well, thanks, I guess. L, stop! God damn it. At least it's not the entire wall of chat anymore. Proof that you should bring it back. No, it made the chat unreadable. Chat, like, it. <laughs> Chat, it felt like I was playing a fucking game with like Twitch interaction, like chat integration on it. It felt like I was in a chat integrated video game, but there wasn't one being played yet. That's, it can't happen. It just can't. Hazardous man, always there's so much freaking energy in the morning. Uh, cold brew coffee, cracked open, gripped and ripped. I'm actually very excited for the stream today, chat. Uh, this is uh, this is a fucking mean game, dude. It comes. It's not so often like a good fucking roguelike sweeps on by. Like an overwhelmingly good fucking game comes up on stream. I had to do a little bit of tinkering for this one because it's one of those games that by default has like noise on it and also because of the way its visuals are conveyed, OBS just kind of goes Ey! But I uh, did some testing on my alternate Twitch account in order to uh, make sure that it looked alright. I was very careful. The secret stream. Well, no, it's an account I made literally today to test. <laughs> no, no, no. It's an account I made today. Because I lost my old alter. Dude, sometimes- Listen, alright, some streamers just turn on any game they want and they don't assume that it'll have any display problems on Twitch. I stream Stalker. I know that the grass in that game devours bitrate. There's not a single fucking way I ever turn on a stream of that game before changing all of my OBS settings. So it's not the account you do fun 3am streams on? No, it's the account where I stare at grass particles wave back and forth. Because for some reason, the biggest test of someone's hardware on Twitch is actually just streaming Stalker. For some reason. And I'll never- I don't think I'll ever understand why it's just Stalker's grass. But people who know, know. Tarkov? No, Tarkov's still lighter than freaking Stalkers. Stalkers has like no softness to the grass textures. They're like these solid fucking cutouts of grass placed infinitely in every direction. 
and they just rip your fucking bitrate to shreds. That's right, I said it. I'm still allowed to. You have to train yourself when you play Stalker on stream to look up more so you're not staring at the grass. make grass point one well that's the thing chat is that like if you turn off all the grass in a game that has grass it doesn't look right <laughs> i'm not about to have all of the quality visual upgrades of like gamma or something like that and then take all the grass out you know it looked like shit it would look like shit so like you kind of just have to find a balance Is Gamma getting multiplayer? No. <laughs> no! It's fine. Listen, I'm a professional. I'm a professional. But yeah, I'm uh I don't know if you if you've noticed, but um I am I am very excited for the Gamma update. I'm not going to do a from scratch stream, I don't think, though. Uh, for the record, I'm uh, likely going to be, like, when I stream it in a couple of days, if that ends up being what I choose to do once I've gotten a hold of the update myself, uh, probably going to do something at mid-game. Because uh, I don't really want to start at the beginning again. I kind of want to do Northern Zones. I kind of want to be in Northern Zones, which are way more difficult to get to now. So... I, I am going to be, like, relatively loaded up. I feel like at this point, everyone that cares about Stalker on my channel knows Stalker and isn't going to be confused if I have, like, tools and, like, gear. And they'd rather see newer content at this point. So, uh, yeah, we're going we're gonna to start from, like, the middle instead. Uh, and that's kind of where I'm at for like a lot of like my longer form game things is I do so much of the beginning that I never get to the middle, which is the best part, like the meat of it, or I just barely get to it and then I burn out. So uh, I've also been eyeballing doing like a cataclysm thing. And if I don't start at the middle of a run, I'm sure as shit going to be doing a hardcore martial arts punch build that won't need to care about anything other than pressing the directional key into an enemy to punch their face off. The only game that I ever refuse to start in the middle of, I think, is Kenshi. Because cutting out Kenshi's start is blasphemous. Cutting out the part where you get eaten by bugs every time you walk outside is blasphemous. The best part of Stalker is when you get a sunrise or similar standard suit. Yeah, like, that's the thing, is that, like, I've done the part where I play Stalker and get, like struggle to get a gun that works and like struggle to get any clothes and i'll tell you what it's a lot of getting hit one time and dying i'll tell you what it's a lot of uh getting shot once and dying and shrugging and quick loading and at a certain point i've played this game for 800 to i've i've 100 played more stalker across every game and every iteration of a mod pack then I have like Binding of Isaac or something, which is like a big say, because I've played a lot of that game. I've played a lot of Binding of Isaac and I feel like I can say I've played more Stalker at this point. Uh, so like, I'm definitely at the point where I wanna like, if I'm gonna stream it now, I wanna be mid game, I think. Should be fun, should be fun. Uh, what I'll probably do, honestly, is use debug mode to spawn in gear and not, like, actively progress my character without, like, people watching. I'll just give myself what I would view as a mid-game loadout and then just move on with my life.
Because I don't really want to, like, load up on reputation or anything off stream. Because I don't really need to. I just don't want to be, like, crawling around in the dirt trying to get, a, like, a fucking gas mask and shit. I'd rather just start with, like, my, like, an actual mid-game starter kit. Short gamma short stream fair. Yeah. Yeah. When you've played the game 500 times, you get bored of the early game. Yeah, that's like honestly the reason that I play so little. Like, I used to be so into Kata's early game. And then I realized that it is the most boring early game of, I think, any freaking game that I play because it is always the same. There is no difference between Cataclysm's early game things. Like, there's, unless you're doing a challenge, there is zero difference in the things you need to do every single time to get kitted out. It's like, yeah, CDDA, the first, li literally the first, like, six hours of the game is chores and menus, and it's like, I just can't fucking do it anymore, man. I just can't fucking do it. And I say that as someone who loves that game. I think RPG-like early game sucks hard in general. I, no, I, there's good RPG-like early games. I think that, for the most part, RPGs don't want to show their entire hand to you in, like, the beginning. I think it's case by case on the game, but obviously, like, most RPGs don't want to show you every bit of their depth earlier. You're going to get bored of it, right? Fear and hunger early is both horrible and amazing. If I see... Listen, I... <laughs> This comes up every once in a while because I'll always get people that recommend I play Fear of Hunger, Fear and Hunger 1 in my fucking recommendations tab, and then I click on the game's goddamn trailer and there's a schlong dangling off of an ogre and like fucking getting dragged along the ground beneath him. Uh, so this is again a PSA. I do not care if they've added censored modes. Stop recommending Fear and Hunger 1 to me for stream. Now I say this and elaborate on it more now because there is a chance I would stream Fear and Hunger 2 because it has less of that. I know because I've played it to some extent. There is a chance I would do the sequel on stream, but I will never do the first one because the first one is too much. I may eventually do Terminus. Funger 2. <laughs> I mean, look, people can also say if they've played through all of the second game. Uh, to my knowledge, it is a bit safer than the first one is uh, for, like, streaming. To my knowledge. Uh, people can correct me if I'm wrong. But it's, like, what from what I played, it's, like, still really fucked up. But it is, it is safer than the first game. There's less constant dick. So, uh, Lobotomy Corp had a horrible early game and book reading story. I think a lot of the early game of Lobotomy Corp was hard because of, um, the translation when I played it. Now I think Lobotomy Corp's early game is deeply, deeply... I think the early game of Lobotomy Corp kind of gets put into perspective when you are forced to restart multiple times because you got fucking owned. Uh, most of Lobotomy Corp is an exercise in... Uh, torture and punishing you for not knowing things you couldn't have known but that's kind of also the magic of it uh it's a fucked up that game's fucked but so is library of runa that game is also fucked and has like a fucking miserable early game they all have miserable early games every game that project moon has made has a miserable early game and it doesn't get better when you get to mid game <laughs> it gets worse because it tells you then you need to grind all the early games still, again. All video games suck. 
can confirm even their gacha. The most tragic thing about those devs is that they made a gacha because I'll never fucking play it. I've talked about this like a dozen times. I will never fucking play it as much as I like I'll say I can say this very, very confidently. I loved Lobotomy Corporation. I fucking adored Library of Runa. Like down to the plot and everything. That was like one of my favorite games of the year. And I will never play uh, Limbus Corporation or whatever the fuck it's called. Limbus Company. I'll never play it because it's a gotcha. Never. Won't do it. I won't do it. A good mess. Yeah, I mean, I've heard it's good. It's just like, it doesn't matter. The 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 business model of it is just too, like, predatory to me. I, I just don't like, I don't like having that kind of, like, shit hanging over my head when I'm trying to enjoy playing a game. I just like being able to pay something up front and be done with it. You know, I need to be free. People, I saw someone in chat say something about a game called Soul Ash 2 coming out. Uh, I thought they only just recently released Soul Ash 1, which I really liked. That was that game where you like run around as like a necromancer, like stealing people's souls and getting like more powerful and like a um, ASCII kind of game. Are they, are, is it already out? Did they already make a sequel? Released! Oh, wait. No. Release date 2023. For some reason, it says on, like, the thing, released on 2023. Early access. Nah, dude, I'm super down for a sequel to this. The first one was kind of rough around some of the edges, but, like, I think that if they, like, worked on it more, it would be fucking awesome. And I think if the dev needs to do another release to, like, actually have the space to keep on chipping away at it, I'm super down. I'll give it a- I'll give that a actual wish list. I'll play that when it comes out. It had great presentation, but not gonna lie, it felt like it had some serious design problems in some areas. Well, that's like something that gives me some comfort about it being like a top-down, like, ASCII-esque game, is that it's very easy, compared to a lot of other genres, to fix design problems. There's not as many moving parts in the way of, like, the, like, bones of the game, you know what I mean? Streets of Rogue with a colleague would be a top tier stream. Thank you for letting me know. I've played it with Dave already. And it's on the VOD show. Streets of Rogue 2. Game is not out. Therefore, irrelevant. Nor will any game come out ever again if it is releasing on Unity. <laughs> Nor will any game ever. That's right, chat. All of your favorite games are gone forever. Woo! Dude, fuck yes! Yes, dude! Dude, I already know how this is going to play out. The Unity thing is going to play out exactly how the freaking open games license bullshit played out for Wizards of the Coast. Everyone's going to be like, I fucking hate these guys. Fuck you guys. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. And then slowly but surely, Unity is going to be like, we've made mistakes and we're going to look into how to fix it. And then 
They're gonna walk it back so fucking hard, but try to still hold some kind of... Look, here's how... Here's the only two ways it plays out. Either A, Unity fucked up big time, and they're gonna have to hand over, like, an insane amount of assurances permanently with, like, a terms of service change so they can never do this again, or people will refuse to use their product. Or B... Unity dumped so much insane bullshit because then when they walk it back, whatever slightly insane bullshit they dump next is going to look so much more acceptable because n everyone will take whatever they can get to not have to deal with the first insane bullshit Unity dumped at their doorstep. It's like one or the other. And both, well, obviously, like the latter one sucks more for everyone else, so I hope, I hope it's the former. Did you hear they removed their TOS from GitHub so people can't see past TOS and incremental changes when they did, did this launch? Dude, fuck them, dude. It's just like hard because like, look, when it comes to something like open games license with like Wizards of the Coast, while well, yeah, it's fucking hard to pivot to an entire new tabletop format, this or that, it's not as hard as rewriting the entire code for your video game to a new engine. So this is a much more difficult pill to swallow, I think, than the, like, Wizards of the Coast shit. It's fucked up. Like, it, this is so much more, like, an insane fucking escalation than Wizards stuff was. It makes the Wizards thing look like fucking, like, absolutely nothing at all. <laughs> but imagine the dopamine rush of being someone who was like, I'm gonna make a video game on Unity and become a professional video game developer. And they were like... 50-50 on which freaking engine they were going to use and they were super nervous about committing to Unity and then the day they started working on their game, Unity did this shit and took a heaving dump all over their own deal and then that person was like, I guess I'm going to not do this one epic. I'm going to go work on Godot engine and they just get like imagine the fucking dopamine hit that must have been for them to like fucking arrive at the perfect time to see the bullshit and fuck off. Think about it. Cruelty Squad is made in Godot, so it wins by default in every case. Cruelty Squad's on God Out and the dev shit talked it a lot. I mean, but dev shit talk every engine. <laughs> Chat, that's that is the thing though. I shit talk Adobe Premiere. I still used it for all of my videos I made. <laughs> like every single fucking platform everyone uses to make art or games or videos or any of that shit sucks eggs. It's just how much it sucks. You learn to hate the platform you use to create the things you want to create. That doesn't mean it's still not the best option for whatever specific thing it is that you're doing, you know? Everyone hates everything. <laughs> You should talk to us every day. Exactly! I fucking hate it here! I loathe this place! I hate it! I'm full of so much anger. Every day. Man. Holy shit. That's why he's moving to Instagram streams. Oh. Oh. No, I don't think so. No, no, no. Do people stream there? I don't know, but like even thinking about it scared away the music of the stream. Dude, there's like some cool stuff coming out. 
uh, like games and stuff coming out this week as well. I'm like, the next week's gonna have some stuff going on, dude. I'm fucking excited. I've been kind of, look, I've got a lot of like big, I like big things I want to do, but it's kind of made it tricky to find things that I want to do for like a one-off thing here or there. Excited for Lies of P, TBH. I wasn't at all. Now here's the thing, I'm going to add as well, uh, I now am because I've seen like reviews and seen like actual real gameplay and I'm like, oh, this actually looks pretty fun. I don't know if I'm going to stream it. Phantom Liberty. <laughs> I might do a one-off cyberpunk stream with a bunch of fucked up mods if they update immediately or like quickly off of cyberpunk just to be like a fucking absolute goon. I might not. No, no, no. I don't think I will. I might. I might. I might. I might deliberately grab like really terrible fucking mods if they work out of the box or like somewhat out of the box with 2.0 as like a one-off 2.0 drops Thursday when does the expansion come out because I don't really care about doing the expansion on stream but I might do like 2.0 with mods the 25th right I mean, like, behind the scenes, what I already know I'm going to do is when 2.0 releases, I'm going to start playing through the game again off stream because I want to do a fresh start for the DLC, which I plan to play at launch on my own because I, despite all the shit that Cyberpunk has attached to it, I really like that game and uh, I'm excited to, like, play the expansion. So, uh, I'm going to play through the game again beforehand, or at least to the point where I've played through it enough to access the DLC. Make Adam Smasher scary. There's not a single fucking way that they could make a dude named Adam Smasher scary. <laughs> There's not a single fucking way you can do that. His name's fucking Adam Smasher, dude. I cringe, dude. I cringe when I hear that. But it's like Atom Smasher, Tomato. I know, and it's the cringest thing I ever fucking heard in my life. I'd rather his name just be like John Kill. Like that would be scarier than Adam Smasher. Like anything scarier than like a fucking pun name, dude. <laughs> like, it's just dumb. It's just dumb. Die Hard Man would have been scarier than Adam Smasher. Yep. I'm not even joking. I would have been more unsettled by knowing that die hard. Like, if I heard a fucking intercom in Cyberpunk while I was, like, shooting guys, and it was like, beep. Die hard man is in the building. Die hard man is in the building. I would have started, like, shitting my pants. I would have started losing it. But yeah, I also like, I mean, that's the thing is that I think building up anyone as like a, this is, a, this character is like an unkillable god. No one's ever beaten him is kind of bullshit in like an RPG game with like constantly escalating stats and numbers that you can hit. Because I'll tell you what, Adam Smasher uh, pretty much got decapitated by my character's uh, revolver in one shot when I, uh, when push came to shove. All right, and it ain't spoilers. Everyone knows eventually you're going to run into the scary guy. Give me a fucking break. And when I ran into the scary guy, I pulled out my gun. Bop! And his head exploded. <laughs> I'm pretty sure... I'm pretty sure he didn't do a move.
Adam <laughs> smashed. <laughs> Dude, I, look. I'll say one thing about Cyberpunk. It's gonna be hard not to when it, look. Look, I'm I'm a simple man. If a game has revolvers in it, that's what I play. That's I I like my hand cannons. I like my big pistols that do. I like my big iron. Okay, I like my big iron. And if there's a big iron in the game, that's my build for my first time playing through. I'm cowboy pilled. Okay, I like my big iron. And I'll tell you what, I didn't regret doing it on my playthrough because, um, well, until I reached endgame because uh, every gun in the game sucked compared to it. I didn't regret it in the sense that, like, I was, I was obscenely strong. I was, but it was like comical because people would use their silly guns. And if I shot someone in the ankle with my revolver, their whole body would explode. Like, I'd hit him in the ankle, and their head would detonate from the damage it caused. It was fucked up. Like, it was... It felt like the kind of power scaling that you get in, a, like, in like a Fallout game. You know what I mean? Like... It felt... It genuinely felt like I was playing, like, a Bethesda product by the end of it. I was... I was just creeping around, shooting people in the ankles, and they were exploding. Whole body, blood, guts. And I wasn't even doing a stealth build. I wasn't playing stealth. I just had a strong gun. I wasn't doing... No, I wasn't doing stealth archer. I was running up to people. <laughs> I was running up to people and pointing my gun in their face while they screamed at me not to kill them. I was playing like a cyber psycho build. Yeah. I can't complain though, because again, I, I was... I was very powerful, and I ran into so few bugs in my playthrough that were, like, actually aggravating that, like, I just had a good time when I played through it, so I'm, like, genuinely just... And I haven't played it since launch, so I'm, I'm excited to, like... I'm honestly excited to play it again with, like, the new update, unless it breaks everything and sucks, at which point I'll be really disappointed because, uh... Boy, oh boy. I'd really... I, I'm, like... Um... It's been long enough that I feel like I'll be kind of going in somewhat, like... Uh, you know, with a fresh mind for it again now. It's CD Projekt, so possibility is very high. I mean, but like... I, look, they had the one bad launch. So I'm not sure that's exactly... Uh, if they had like a two, three games where they had terrible, terrible situations... Uh, they had the one. <laughs> they had the one bad one. To my knowledge, unless I fucking actually brain deleted like another, like they've done pretty good DLCs, especially. Wasn't Witcher 3 a mess at launch or am I mistaken? Well, that should be even, if Witcher 3 was a mess at launch, which I don't remember. I don't remember having problems at launch. Uh, but if it was a mess at launch and now people can pretty easily agree that Witcher 3 is a fucking, you know, very stable masterpiece, then uh, that gives me a little more confidence that this will probably be a pretty good sign. It's not like it's not like these devs really had to put as much effort into like a 2.0 update. They didn't have to do it. They could have packaged it all into the DLC and cashed out. So I feel like if there's no real pressure on their end to do this at all, uh, they're not going to fucking slip up. They had to. No, they didn't. They could have just made it stable. They didn't need to give us a bunch of free extra shit on the patch. And like new content. They could have paywalled it. They could have paywalled it all into the expansion. The reputation would have been the toilet, I reckon. Yeah, but Bethesda's reputation is in the fucking toilet, and then they released Starfield and still sold a billion copies. No one gives a shit about reputation. 
You think if they made a Witcher 4, you're not going to fucking buy it after how shit Cyberpunk's launch was? Yeah, right. You're going to get on a fucking soapbox. You're going to yell about how it's going to be trash. And then as soon as it comes out, you're still going to buy it. Give me a break. Give me a break, consumer. We hate Bethesda people on their way to buy Starfield. I even I even talked shit about Starfield and I still bought the $100 early access. I refunded it and I don't own Starfield right now because I didn't have time to play it, but I was ready to play it early. We consume here. All right? Stop acting like we don't. I'm easily influenced. Every moment of my life, I am being sold a product. I love buying new games. Surprise. Hell yes. What is this message? Tomato, I put your voice into voice cell and the result was, well, don't worry, champ. Voice isn't everything. You're still funny. What the fuck does that mean? What did you do? He AI'd you. You AI'd me? What the fuck? What the fuck does that mean, intimidating message? I barely understand what you just said to me. <laughs> Non-fungible tomato. Voice cell judges how chad your voice is. That cannot be what that is. Voice cell tells if you're a Giga Chad deep voice or a high pitched dweeb. Dude, I'll take uh, I'll take having a voice with a lot of range, which I know my voice has, over being a deep voice Giga Chad voice any day of the goddamn week. As far as someone that has to full time stream for the rest of their life until they die. Chad, I had to mute my microphone for a second. <laughs> Damn, dude, I can't believe I have the voice of a high pitched dweeb. Sheesh. I guess I'll just I guess I'll just use my real voice now. Which is just Gorgonzola. Forever. mock him he's already dead you sound like morty no i fucking actually honestly honestly i totally gorgonzola's voice totally stretched into sounding like morty after like session two or session one it started as not but then it became 
Dude has a cringe voice, LOL, while there are other streamers. What the fuck? <laughs> has been subbed for 33 months. Didn't notice until an AI told him. <laughs> My career! Wait! Wait! That's a zoomer right there. Let the AI tell him what's cool. That AI has been training for freaking years on people's voices and figuring out who has game and who is way lame. Okay? And I trust it with my life. Do you understand? Pog, I got unmodded. Damn, it's back. Yeah, you're not going freaking anywhere. <laughs> yeah, sorry. Chat, but am I not the premier dweeb voice streamer? That's the thing. Am I not? Am I not a premier dweeb voice streamer? I have no brand. I am I am brandless and maybe that's what makes me relatable. You know? I have no brand, I have no recognition. My SEO is in fucking shambles. You look me up and you just get freaking actual, like, f like tips to be like a farmer. You can't do, I can't do anything. And then you get pictures of Fortnite. No matter where I go, I am unknown. And now I have AI punching down at me and trying to take me down. When's the Fortnite with the boys stream? At one point, Dave and I were going to stream Fortnite together. At one point. I don't know what happened to there, uh, what happened to that, like where that went, but uh, we changed our mind and never spoke of it again. Please do it. No. And alas, now Dave is retired. And never, ever, 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 ever streaming again. And dead. <laughs> it's just so sad that he died and then proceeded to retire. Damn, man. Damn. Damn, man! Damn! Never forget. It's 
tomato, my girlfriend thinks your voice is weird and I can't watch you when she's around. Frown. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> What the? I, I I actually got like stunned. I couldn't breathe. Old tinnitus voice. Huh? <laughs> why why is chat doing this to me dude if not for me you'd be where, where would you be right now you'd just be at a different stream what am i even i'm just gonna go to the bathroom and then i'm gonna start playing the game Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. How do I know that someone didn't just like put in like the fucking worst sound bites of me for that voice cell thing? How do I know? How do I know? How do I know? You don't. Do it yourself. No. <laughs> no. No. <laughs> If I do it myself and it tells me live that I'm that I'm a dweeb, I'll literally die. The only the only protection I have right now is that I cannot confirm it. Don't be scared. I have to be. I'll do it. The, nope. If anyone does it. That is it me, then all I'll ever do is cope if it's not the answer I want. But if I do it, then I have to confront reality. And as long as I don't ever do that, I get the best of both worlds. I get to cope as much as I want, and I never get to know the truth. He doesn't believe I would use good voice clips. Why am I here? <clears throat> It's not that I don't believe you would use good voice clips. It's that no matter what happens, I'm going to have to believe, I, I have to continue to cope. No matter what. I have to cope. Quantum dweeb. Holy shit. I'm not a quantum dweeb. <laughs> Schrodinger's dweeb. <laughs> Quantum dweeb is actually a good tag. What color are your socks today? You don't want to fucking know that. And you'll never know it. I'm not telling anyone. 
gray shirt, white socks. I'm running! Okay, what do you want from me? As soon as the stream ends, I have to go run! No, you're not! Yes, I am! I'm gonna have 10 minutes of space. Yes, I fucking am, Lena. I'm gonna have space. <laughs> I'm gonna have time. I will have time. Run where? To the kitchen? To the fucking treadmill! Is the roguelike the game or the pre-stream? What the fuck does that mean? He dies at the end of every pre-stream. Will you restart the run? Probably not gonna run after stream, but I am wearing a gray shirt. I am gonna run after the uh, thing we do, though, Lena. I have to. White socks. That's right. Right now, chat, I'm wearing white fucking socks. Throw them out. No. No. Glass cannon run. That's been the story of my whole fucking life. All right. Huge damage potential. I have huge damage potential. What's going on? Why are Katie and Lana fighting? If you wear black socks, you're actually weird. My god. Do we have like two sides? Normal people wear only white socks. Everyone who wears white socks is a freak. Okay. <clears throat> it seems like there is a split. It seems like a war is happening. People will have to choose sides soon. There will be no place for centrists anymore! A great war is, is raging in the chat! Poll now. Poll now. We need a poll. Oh boy. Oh boy. I don't know if we really want a poll chat. Who the fuck cares? Hey, wait a minute. 
That guy says what we're all thinking. Hey, wait, wait, who was that guy? Hang on. The, they already got buried by the swarm. Ban, ban. <laughs> I care though, I'm banning him. Oh my God. Fucking hell. 19 KD4. Jesus. Jesus Christ. My, my fucking god. All right, chat, look. All right, I'd love to hang out here all day and just talk in the intro, but last, uh, last I checked, uh, if we remain here even another second, I'm going to have to continue to talk about socks and feet for like the next 30 minutes and I just don't really think I have that kind of strength. I uh I don't think I do. You know, I I wish I no I don't want. I I I don't wish I did. I'm I'm glad I don't have the strength. The centrist take. I have been I have been under attack all intro. I have been given not a moment's rest. I take a punch, and then in the recoil of that punch, I am stopped because I got punched again, going in the other direction, in a rapid fire machine gun blast of swings. I have not been able to recover for even a moment. W but a W for white socks. Are these W's even for me anymore? Or are they just for like concepts? You like white socks? I don't like any socks. I wear them out of necessity because my circulation in my hands and feet is so bad that if I don't wear something on my feet and hands, sometimes I'll die. Okay? I'm not with any of you. <laughs> Wait. Wait, I have something to say. I'm not with any of you. <laughs> I stood up for you. Yeah, well, now I'm getting away from all of you. I saw a window to escape and I took it. Ah, uh, yes. Tomato has to feel unique in his opinions. Look, dude, the second I realize I'm just part of the pack, I have to do something to differentiate myself again. All right? No matter what, The Vegeta. Y'all want to play this Mortal Sin game? How do you guys feel about sin? How do y'all feel about the idea of sin? I love sin, dude. So, uh, this, uh, this roguelike has, um... Has some reviews, dude. Uh, it's rare that a roguelike comes around and actually has reviews, man. It's gonna be a good time. I got a good feeling. It's got some fucking crunchy combat. Some hefty amounts of content. Some pretty cool fucking stuff going on. Good reviews. 
overwhelmingly positive. Reviews. The kinds that you don't see every day. The kinds that you don't see every day. Tragically made on Unity. <laughs> Tragically soon going to be gone. But until then, here we are. Yes, that's right. There is not a doubt in my mind this is a Unity game. Every game you know and love. Unity. All of them. Soon to be completely destroyed. City Skylines 2, also Unity. Nah, dude, I've never played City Skylines. Uh, whenever I try to play a city builder, I always think about frickin' Tropica, or Tropico, and then I, like, get distracted thinking about Tropico, and then I stop playing them. Because the only city builder I can play is Tropico. Or I get distracted. And I don't know why. Good, I like Tropico. My gotchas! Listen, here's what Unity should have done, is said, we're going to charge Gotcha Games $8 billion to keep on using our license because they do have the money. Just them, though. That's all they should have done, was just said, if you have a gotcha set up, uh, we want some of that fucking bag. I would have been okay with that because I don't care about gotcha games. But the, I, when, when they came for the gotcha games, I would have said nothing. It's only when they came for the things I like that I would say something. You know, I would happily stand aside if they went after everything Sam knows and loves. I would not dare say a word. I would not say even a whisper. Throwing so much shade at Sam. Ain't his birthday no more, motherfucker. <laughs> Ain't his... I held off for 24 hours. That's plenty. Someone's got to keep him humble. He's your winch brother. Listen. I would go to hell and back to help winch him out of a big old pile of mud. I would. But I also have to be the person who looks at his his gotcha and says, man, you need some fucking help. What the hell's going on, man? What the hell's going on, dude? Look at you. All right? He'd do the same for me. He'd do the same for me. All right? Plus, I'll never forgive him for uh, actually managing to uh, convince me that I had stolen his VR headset. Uh, I'll never let that go. Uh, and till the day I die, I'll continue to do whatever I can to take swings at him. Because eventually they may pile up to the equivalent feeling I had when I had to uh, do mental gymnastics in my head to figure out where the fuck his VR headset had disappeared to in my house. Do you understand? You can maybe forgive him by give by giving him back his VR headset. No, 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 because there's nothing to give. There's nothing to give, though. I think Tomato forgot this was a gaming stream. Smidge. Oh, yeah? <laughs> well, don't you look pretty silly right now. Holy. Man, oh, man. 
Said that a little too soon, huh? Pressure to start game. No, it's just when it reaches like an hour and ten minutes, I've I've reached the point where I'm like, I also do want to play this today. If I go any longer, then I may not. You know, that's how it always goes. Mortal sin. He gets bored of us. Listen, it's only there's only so much time I can handle like concentrated lethal doses of toxicity before I have to like step away and figure out my shit. You know? Can we get rid of some of these tags, Tomato? Like what? Let's see. English, terminally average, toxic streamer, toxic mods, final stream, old yeller, band fan, live, laugh, love, dripless. Where did that one come from? Yeah, I know one to get rid of. The one that I don't remember adding, uh, for one. Uh, I, I think we get rid of that one. Maybe. Maybe that one. Yeah. How about old yeller? No. No, not until I'm done with Garden of Bam Bam 3 and 4. Not a moment before that. But what about adding Quantum Dweeb? Get rid of Dripless, add Quantum Dweeb. That's fine. We'll add Quantum Dweeb, alright? We have AI to confirm that one. No one can... Be, me being Dripless is still... Like, the jury's out on that one. People, people don't know that. They can't prove it. The jury is not out. We know that. No, you fucking don't! Sam confirmed that. Sam hasn't seen me in like, like fucking six years. Tragically. <laughs> you calling Sam a liar. I am saying he doesn't know. All he sees of me is me from the frickin' like mid chest up on webcam for a frickin' Godforge. He doesn't know. He doesn't know. And even that is bad. I'm uh, gonna play the game now. I'm gonna get new glasses, idiot. <laughs> Fuck you! <laughs> I like my glasses, and they're relatively new. Holy shit! <laughs> <laughs> Classic. Dark glasses. Can we say one nice thing about tomato? I don't know, can they? I don't know. I don't I don't know. I don't know. I don't I don't know. Can they? He has a great ass. Thank you. Thank you. And that's true and proven. That's actually true and proven and real. So thank you. I have lore about that. That's lore. All right. Mortal sin. Hang on, I'm gonna turn this shit off. I gotta get the freaking thing in the background off. There we go. Dude, I'm mad at him for real. Wait, what? <laughs> what happened? I wanna, I wanna play the game. I wanna play the game, but now, now, now there's like more things happening. What's happened? What happened? Then play the game. Hang on. Now I gotta find out why you're mad at me for real. <laughs> he doesn't really care. Hang on. I do really care. And that's why I'm clicking on... I have to literally go through your, like, chat log. <clears throat> L. Fake comment. I hate his stream and I hate being here. He's awful. Classic dork glasses. Uh, are you saying athletic shorts and socks with sandals helps you? Uh, that, where's, uh, so what, what did I, what did I do? <laughs> what did I do? <laughs> mm. 
Yo, what's up, Junie? The uh, the chat was just thinking about nice things to say to me. Uh, they were trying really hard, as you can tell by the uh, like some of the past comments and messages. They were trying very hard to do it. What are you looking at me for? That's it. I'm playing the video game. <laughs> Mortal sin. Overwhelmingly positive. What are the odds? Eyes locked on your prey. You will kill with no remorse. After all, it's either you or them, right? Sentience is fleeting. And this moment is your release. Oh. All right. The sky is red with blood. We are... This game is awesome. This game is fucking awesome. It like totally came out of nowhere. Hello. Uh, Helena. You approach the mysterious masked woman and she begins to take notice. Oh, it's you, the struggler. I've heard much about you from the voice within. My name is Helena and I am afraid I can't remember much else. Oh, okay. You see, not too long ago I lived a different life. Oh, so you do remember. Although I cannot recall the details. Oh, okay, so she can't. I can sense the remnants of a soul long forgotten, and it whispers to me from time to time. After a long pause, her lips begin to curl into a slight smirk. If my stay is any indication, then you might be here for quite a while. I am not high enough leveled to ask Helena what the voice within means. I'd have to be level one to do that. So uh, I'm not gonna bother. <clears throat> so hang on here, I'm gonna take a look around and uh, we're gonna run through all the tutorial stuff. Quest for absolution. You must complete the dungeon, cave and forest to reach final judgment. The order of completion does not matter, but all three areas must be completed in a single run. And this is the entire progress map for the game. It looks like during uh, any progression during these dungeons, we will unlock certain permanent rewards for our account. Okay. <coughs> Hang on, I gotta clear my throat. Yeah. This color scheme is crazy. You can actually change it when you get to higher levels as well. Uh, so you can switch the palettes around. Hang on, attack. Keep holding for a power strike or whirlwind. Normal left and rights. Power attack is a whirlwind swing. Block, right click. Block right before you get hit for a parry. Do in pallet. Shut the fuck up! Space to kick. Okay. Bash stuns enemies and breaks their guard. Bash is affected by weapon speed and damage. Kyle the German thanks for the five gifted subs. So this is the bash. And if I hold W, I actually move a little bit faster when I do that. Uh, ability. Each class has a powerful, unique ability. Killing enemies reduces your ability's cooldown. What is mine? Become invincible and gain one combo multiplier. Your combo multiplier does not expire while Awaken is active. Okay. And this is, uh, some guy. Divino. Ready for a sparring session? You can practice your combos and parry safely with me. How would you like to... How would you like for me to act? Uh... uh aggressive. Immediate parry. Ow! That's a perfect parry. Okay. So kick interrupts him. So I can interrupt any of his attacks with a kick, but I don't do much damage, I don't think. Oh, it does build my combo. Uh, how about my bash? That does two hits. Okay. Cool. And this. Dude, chill. Relax. The dungeon lies ahead. What kind of horrible nightmares await us down? I'm gonna look around before I go in there, though. Just give me a second. There's no, like, sprint in this game, but there is mashing the shift key to bash. So I think as I get, like, stronger and faster with my stats, I'll be able to do that, like, more. Bah, 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 bah. What is this strange contraption? That looks so silly. 
Look, it'll be a lot more- it'll be a lot less silly when I'm using it to punch someone's head off. Let's take a look around here. Uh... This is nothing. And this is... some spooky statue of a skeleton. Bunch of crap. Funny looking guy. Not much of anything here either. The forest! To unlock the forest, you must first complete Dungeon B5 or Cave B5. Okay, so that would be the third dungeon then. So, uh, we know where the dungeon is. Then I suppose this here must be... the cave. Oh. I'm gonna go through the dungeon, <clears throat> and not, um... Wait, 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 wait. May you never rest to death, so zero victory, zero. I'm gonna go through the dungeon. Kyle the German, thanks for another five gifted subs. Awfully kind of you, thank you. Thanks! Shall we? Ow! Hang on. Just wanna practice my parry quick, because I'm not very good at it. Okay, that's a real one. If I just hold it, I do technically block. No matter what. And I see the bar for it. Okay. That's a real one. Why do you fart when parrying? I think it's like a shockwave to knock enemies back. The dungeon. Looks like we're sealed in now. Hang on. 25 damage, 1 speed. Attack, we know how that works. Defense reduces all damage taken. Speed increases attack and movement speed. And luck increases my crit chance and chance to find rare items. Understood. I would have assumed the dungeon would have a sky. Or a ceiling, I guess. I guess I wouldn't have assumed it to have a, like, infinite expanse above me. Unequipped sword? Yeah, you can punch in this game. Hang on, there's actually things inside of these urns. Orbs! They seem to be powering up my blue goblet. We must keep our wits about. Hang on, there's arrows on the ground telling me where to go, and a chest here with uh, boots of vitality on it. I can choose to equip them or sell- A creature! Oh, they attack each other. Hang on, this- I might not even need to fight this ghoul. Ah! Okay, so there's actually decapitation and dismemberment in this game to the point now where this guy will only now be able to attack me with his head, and now that he doesn't have a head, all he can do is kind of walk around until I put him down the rest of the way. Just for the record, so you understand how this game works, enemies don't die until they've been completely decapitated and dismembered 100%. So all I have to do now is take their legs off and he's gone. Parrot. Taken down in one swing. And one thing that the game doesn't convey to you, which is important, is um, when you use any of your weapons, they take durability. When you take damage, your armor takes durability damage. You replenish it by using the blue potions with V. If they break, they disappear forever and they're gone. Oh, a giant fucking cleaver to use as a new weapon. I'll be taking that. Oh! Ha! We're going to take it slow and careful. We've activated the one pressure plate I need to use to go down to the next floor, so technically we can leave whenever we want. Sword of Brutality. With one luck on it, I'll be taking that open all these boxes. We're going to start moving a little bit quicker. I'm going to make sure I collect all these things. It's good money. Alright. Time for the one run, one pump roguelite king. I am pretty good at my roguelites. And I want to make sure I loot everything. All these chests. A chest! A real chest! A hundred gold to open and within it a cleaver of brutality. Uh, technically that's better than my cleaver. And I'm gonna recycle the old one for ten dollars. A legendary berserking sword. You're invulnerable during whirlwind, but it consumes durability when I do that. I'll take it. I need to start remembering to use my ability. 
I'm already starting to move very quickly with my shift move. I'll start, start getting a little bit more aggressive. Jesus Christ! Hang on. Seems like my bash into, seems like I actually have like combos that activate off of swings. So if I bash with shift, my next attack seems to be like a heavy overhead no matter what, and it instantly killed that guy. Hang on, I wanna, what happens if I, okay, and if I kick and then do something, I do a stab. Okay. Helmet of brutality, two luck. Whoa, what the fuck? Not exactly sure what just happened right there, but I'm gonna choose to ignore it for now and keep moving on. Hit the paddle. Parry! Okay, and that was a perfect parry. I wouldn't be able to spin right now. Berserking axe, we're gonna take that. We have two berserker. Man, this is a big ass weapon, dude. Holy. Let's get kitted entirely and sell some of this other stuff. Explore the rest of this place. Okay, I, I can't really read that swing. Hang on. There we go. Yes. Gloves. Boxing gloves. Unarmed block prevents all damage and punches deal more damage. I mean, I, it's worth just taking. Damn! Power strikes trigger a magic blade spell. Ah, uh, it's kind of a downgrade for both of my weapons, but I at least want to see it. Hang on. Okay. That's pretty... Does it work on the uh, spin attack? Holy heck, that's cool, actually. Uh, I'm still gonna take the Berserker stuff, though, and just sell that. Onwards! Deeper into the dungeon! I will beat this whole game in one run. I've unlocked the Halberd forever. By progressing to this part of the dungeon. And, uh, this is, um... Chains of Ice. Dismembering Legs has a 10% chance to freeze nearby enemies. Bash and Punch deal 110% damage. Or Power Strikes deal 105% damage. Whirlwind has a higher duration. Mods, we could probably do a uh, Gamba for this game on each of the dungeon, like, zones. Like, Zone 1, 2, and 3. If we want to get, uh, get some pointless numbers involved. And so I've only done, like, floor one of five for this one. Just if you die or not, if I die or not, on each of the zones. So, dungeon, cave, you can do it per each zone, because, uh, I know once I finish a zone, I go back up to the top. And I have, like, time to, like, look around and do other things before I do another zone. So it's a pretty easy spot to reset on. I'm gonna take this one, Dismembering Legs has a 10% chance to freeze nearby enemies. Look at the points! He really thinks he's gonna beat a level lull. Oh, yeah? Are you fucking challenging me? How about- Go ahead and doubt, dude. Hell, yo. Great Wombologist. Go ahead and doubt. I, what's the doubt? What's the number if you doubt? What's the number? Which one is it? Was it two? I want to see you doubting. I want to see you type in the chat that you're doubting. I want to see doubt. Let me see. Let me see the doubt. Two twenty. Holy shit! That dude put a lot of points on doubt. Kyle the German, thanks for gifting ten subs to the channel. I'm about to pop off. Check this one out. I'm about to pop off. What is this? Ah! Oh. I'm gonna sip a potion and heal. I don't know what the fuck that was. But it scared me. What the fuck? I'm fine. That doesn't mean anything. Uh, looks like I can buy health potions or wizard oil here. Okay. <laughs> Better them than me. New sword. I'm gonna sell the old one because I already have a berserking weapon. Enemies may explode on death. 
I'm getting some pretty crazy weapons uh, so far. Damn! Dude, doubters are already looking pretty foolish, I'm gonna be honest. Hi. Gloves. Uh, I honestly want the attack and speed more than I care about boxing. And a chest to open. Worthless. Worthless stats, we move on. Come. We have work to do. I need to start using my ability that gives me invul- Half moon, kick, bash, attack, unleashes a fast power strike. Kick, bash, attack. Hang on. Kick, bash, attack. Is it that one? Or am I not doing the full bash long enough? Kick, bash. Did I do, did I read it wrong? Hang on. Progress. Kick, bash, attack. Kick, bash. I'll try it when I actually see someone. What's this? Pressing every floor plate will respawn all enemies, but plus one item level for drops and minus 21% staff durability loss. I don't, I haven't seen a staff in the whole game, but I like the idea of more killing and more uh, item level. But I'm, I'm not gonna take it because it's only plus one. Oh, this is a killer room. Kick! Bash! Hang on! Kick! Bash! Attack! Uh, okay, I'm pretty strong. Jesus, I am strong. Ha! Creatures! Be gone! Ha! 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 Doubters. What's up? Doubters! Holy shit. What's going on over there? You guys all right? What the? Perfect parry. Kyle the German with another five gifted subs. Thank you, Kyle. Boots of haste, I'll be taking those. You dare approach me? Dead, like the others. Okay, so this is a, like a trap wall. It's gonna get rid of it. What are you? Purge curse. Remove a random challenge orb curse uh, while retaining its bonuses. Okay. Jesus, this sword is crazy actually. It's good to know that those exist. So I'm not stuck with curses. Halberd. It's still worse than what I have. I'm just going to sell it. Whoa! Concussive Sickle of Haste. Power Strikes and Bashes stun all nearby enemies. That's, uh... I mean, I'm not really using this. The sword's really good, the explosion. I'm going to take... I'm going to swap the axe. Holy shit! I like. What's the power attacks like? Okay, power one is a uh, overhead swing. Two uh, is still that. And then this is also a whirlwind. Okay. My light attack is a fucking whirlwind swing, chat. Oh, hang on. Hi. Worthless shoes. Why do I feel like the thing that's going to damage me the most in this game isn't even going to be the enemies. It's going to be ads. I mean, no, fucking not ads. Like, the traps like this. My brain's all rattled from, like, the roguelike number game I'm already doing in my head. Like, it's going to be all the traps. Crafting anvil unlocked. You can now craft powerful weapons and equipment in the starting area. Okay. As soon as I collect another perk. Chains of Ice 2. Ah, uh, with only 3% more gain isn't very good. Three times our higher combo multipliers make your staff attack. I don't have a staff. 
Uh, we're gonna take the one that boosts my armor level. And move on. You there! Face me! Parry it! I do kick me bad. Kick bash swing. Okay, I can see how much damage the power attack does. It does use this visual, but uh, it's definitely activating. I can see my weapon glow for a second when it activates. When I do it right. Kick, kick bash swing. It's like very quick with this weapon. Long sword of power. Absolutely worthless. Halberd, useless to me. What the? Oh, there's a staff. Summons deadly rotating crosses. Every time you critically strike, your next attack will also be a critical strike. Uh, can I just like see how this looks? Okay. I'll take it. So what are like the moves on this thing? Okay, so I'm just doing that every time I swing it and it makes, it uses some durability to do it. How much damage does it do? Very cool weapon, dude. I like this. I'm still gonna stick with the scythe for now, but that's pretty fucking cool. Especially considering it stays on my character even when I'm not using it. What the? Huh? Worthless halberd. Hang on, I'm gonna loot this place before I do anything. Whoa! Good to know that I can cancel this spin whenever I want by right-clicking. Have I not been wearing a shirt this whole time? Oh my god, the doubters don't even know that I'm not at my full power. You're immune to scares. I don't know what a scare is, but I'm glad I'm immune to it. Nothing's gonna be scaring me anymore, chat. What chance do you possibly have? Twos. What is this? Where am I? Oh! Are you a scare? That was a sc Felt scared? Oh, that is a scare. Chat, good news. I'm immune to those now. Do your worst. Pathetic. Oh, it's hurting my armor bad. Look at my durability. Okay, let's try to avoid getting hit by more of those either way. Crafting anvil. Spend gold essence to craft powerful items. I'm not done. There's like more down there. That's like an exit, I think. I want to do the other, the other half. Holy shit. 16 attack. Yeah, we're taking those gloves. Let's roll. We're gonna do this quick. Go! Go! Easy. Perk upgraded, and we move. The doubters are gonna get owned, dude. Uh, speed up. Melee weapons consume less durability. Yeah, we're taking that. Damn, I got a pretty good fucking lineup of gear so far, chat, for first dungeon. I've watched this. Scares will fire, fire projectiles at you. Scares no longer grant invincibility on release. Well, good news is I'm immune to scares. Uh, so I'm gonna take that. Right now I am immune to it. What is this? I'm gonna take a swig out of my uh, durability potion just to make sure everything's repaired before I drop in. Oh my fucking God. Creature! Oh! Look at you! Pathetic! Die! Strange ghoul. The treasures of this place are mine. Armor mastery, even more powerful than before. Long sword of power, that's trash, and I don't want it. How- Hellfire 
of haste. I don't want that either. Yet. Uh, brutality armor. I'm trying to stick with the fearless armor so I don't get owned here. So I'm going to stick with what I have for now until I find something that replaces it properly. Soulful cleaver of haste. I kind of want it for the extra speed. Honestly. Yeah. Look at how fast my bash is now, chat. Holy shit. What is this? A room full of treasure. Uh, that's a huge buff for attack and defense. I'm going to take it. That was a protection. Nah, I like what I have. Reach on this halberd, or this cleaver is pretty lame. Take half of all damage. Honestly, dude, that's fucking crazy. I'm not too afraid of the scares. There haven't been that many, and they seem pretty dodgeable if I'm fast. Jesus Christ. Take reduced damage from traps and poison. Cannot be slowed. Speed feels really good in this game. Ooh. The loot in this game feels very punchy. Like, I, I, I'm getting drowned in a lot of stuff that's very good. Render your health a few seconds after taking damage. And then gloves of haste. Nah, I don't want those. Dude, look at the speed of this. Holy crap. Let's repair everything and, uh... A lot of doubters just had to pay out a lot of money. Zone 1 is done. A lot of doubters just lost a lot of money. We'll get them next time. What's up? Remember me? I'm way stronger now. You must complete- I thought I am level 1. Levels are gained by completing quests. What the fuck is going on? Whatever. I guess I'm not- I guess I'm not even level 1 yet. Level 0 gamer. The cave is down this tunnel. Get it twisted. Keep doubting you will win big. <laughs> Don't worry, chat. You will win big. He didn't see his latest unlock? Hang on. Let me take a look at the progress screen. You have partially proven your worth. Uh. Well, Chad, I've partially proven my worth. Which looks like I've unlocked half of the trial of resolve. I'm going into the next one. The cave. Why is the screen like this? It's the art style, and I think the art style in this game is pretty freaking. I think considering- you know what it reminds me of? It reminds me of that game, uh, Bullets Per Minute. In that, the dev very obviously has taken a lot of assets from the Unity store, and has reworked it visually in a way that makes sense for the game they're trying to make, and then focused on the gameplay rather than the visuals beyond that. And that's like kind of what this is right now. What just happened? I'm sealed in here, the cave. Mother of God. Hang on. Man, the reach on this cleaver is so bad. What the fuck kind of attack was that, asshole? I forgot that if I cut off their legs, they turn into ice cubes. Creature! Ow! Jesus! I mean, I my character's weapons go crazy, chat. Jesus Christ! Ow! The most damage I took was that thing hitting me. 
Yeah, I'm not sure I'd be doubting after seeing that right there, seeing what just happened. I just got a lot of really good loot, too, from that, like, random enemy. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna take that, actually. Sell that. Gloves. Don't need them. And these are perks. Holy crap. My armor drops are about to get a little silly. Chat. Trash. Trash. Was that roundhouse kick? I'm kind of looking at the numbers more than I'm looking at the abilities right now. I think that said roundhouse kick. Did that dude just try to become an elite in front of me and then I turned him into freaking goo? Before he could even respond? Sometimes there are enemies in front of me and then they just turn to dust. Before they have a chance to- What is- I don't want to like go in that stuff. I keep waiting. How- Man, how's this trap on the wall been alive this long? It died. It's dead. Oh, you're a necromancer. Okay. Spear- My weapons don't get as good as my armor does. With- Jesus. Well, it would be uh, a lot more damage than the concussive sickle. Be a little bit slower, but it'd be like double the damage. Well, if I need something with reach, I guess this is what I'd use. That's a lot of reach. Yeah, that's pretty good. Uh. Essence seems good. No. No, 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 no. Jeez, even with how slow this weapon is, look at how fast the bash makes my dash. Does the hitbox on the stab linger? Yeah, I noticed that. Looks like you can kind of sweep it over enemies. Jesus Christ! I'm sorry. I did not know it was going to be like that. Sell it. Everything else in this place is trash. We move on. How are overwhelming unlocked? Consuming wizard oils will increase your damage temporarily. Cool. I kind of want to just boost my, uh, armor mastery to maximum at this point. It feels like the best option. Hello. This weapon is fucking cracked. Dude, I just sweep my mouse over their body and touch every single one of their limbs and they just die. <laughs> Goodbye. Okay, bye. Bye-bye. Bye. Bye bye bye. <laughs> I'm not entirely sure what that attack was I just did right there, though. These guys literally don't know where I am. Look at him. He doesn't know. He's gonna walk into this axe trap. If I leave him, he'll just die on his own. Bye. Where's the actual enemy? Oh. I thought there'd be like a necromancer and this guy might just be one of the necromancer summons. No, he's real. Does this actually damage me? Yup. Just very slowly. Take a swig. Hmm. Just swapping out some stats. Uh, honestly, I don't need more attack or HP. I need damage and speed. Let's swap it. I think damage and speed are better for me right now. Whoa, like look at how fast I get out of that shit, chat. Did you see that? Look at how fast my backdash is. If 
Fucking hell. Whoa. I've, uh, never seen a weapon quite like this before. Is that my bash? Holy ow! Oh shit, ow. 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 Okay, I gotta wake up. Wake up, I did take damage. Really bad damage right there. Traps are doing damage to me. They're doing damage. I have to wake up! Fuck you! Boxing gloves, don't care. Those are trash. Prepare my shit, let's get the hell out of this place. I'm not gonna die, chat. I plan on winning this video game. In one run. Oh shit, I just missed the chest. Stop getting comfortable, this is a dungeon of death. Well... Whirling Dervish unlocked. Bash, kick, attack, attack. Unleashes a whirlwind. The fact I don't need to charge to do that makes that the most OP fucking combo in the video game. Are you kidding me? What? It's harder to do on a slow weapon because I actually have to wait for the animation to stop. Dude, I can do it with this one though too. Attacking the uh, uses durability. It does on this weapon because this weapon shoots out like uh, swords when it uses a charge attack. I'm not afraid. Enemies can go ahead and be faster and attack faster. I don't fear them. What is this? Hello? Bash! Kick! Attack! Attack! Bash! Kick! I'll just keep on using it. Oh my god. I need a heal. Just, uh, just need a second. Bash! I just gotta keep on remembering the combo. As long as I keep on doing the spin move, I can't die! Gotta get rid of all these ads. Nice and simple. Fucking hell, this game is fun, dude. Holy shit. Jesus. Just you and me now. It's as simple as that. Average Dark Souls Halberd player. I switched. I switched to my one-handed weapon. Ow! Fuck! Dude, I'm gonna die to traps. There's no way I don't die to traps. Right? Like... I'm absolutely dying to normal traps. I have no health potions. Who are you? Who was that goon? I don't understand. I didn't mean to drink that. That was my last potion. Okay, this is an elite. Or was an elite. That guy was also a character that should have been alive longer, it feels like. Man, this this sword is just really strong. This shield one is kind of crazy. My armor mastery rises in strength yet again. Just cutting through these guys like fucking butter out of here, dude. Jesus. Believers are starting to shake. They don't feel too hot. Hey. Hey, are you feeling okay? Uh, this is also... Mm, wave blade is good, but I don't think it's more important than everything else. I don't want more speed. What did you think was going to happen? Pathetic. You're nothing to me. 
Just gotta take it slow. Haste gloves, not worth it. Trash. Just take it all slow. We don't do too many bashes. We gently... Man, we have 27,000 gold. And I feel like I'm spending my money every single time. Oh my god. It's less damage. Hang on, let me compare this. The, the, the spear is good, but it takes so long to swing that I think it's useless. Compared to the hot streak one. Like, it's gonna be useless with how fast these enemies are now. Uh, this is worth ditching now. Yeah, I need, I need a helmet with stats on it. Ooh. I want to be even faster. Just keep making me really fast. I want to be very quick, you see. I want to just be able to cleave everyone in twain. Uh, I don't know what's up with that every time that happens. Woo! Nah, that's for the... Uh, I don't need that. The scares keep trying to get me, but they never will, dude. They're never gonna get me. A little too quick. We go yet now even... D Hang on. It's every 10 seconds. Nothing even in the chest. Are you kidding? Okay, I'm out of here. What the hell was that about? Sinful offering unlocked. You can now increase your stats in the starting area for a high cost. Okay. More armor mastery. Just keep pumping my armor at this point. Oh man, it's just really good first person combat. It feels fucking great to play this game. Hang on. I have been getting like rapid fire texts from Verizon about my plan all fucking day and I don't know what I did to deserve it. I'm blocking their number. <laughs> I don't know what I did to deserve Verizon's wrath like this. But it's not like we're canceling your plan. It's like a here's some here's a bunch more bonuses you could get for your plan and I just don't care. They won't leave me alone. What's on the boots? Whoa. I could be even faster than I am now. Ah! Sorry, that wasn't a very brave sound I made, Chad. I'm sorry. I should put on a braver uh, show than that. You aren't very brave. Yes, I am. I'm like the bravest person. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Creatures. One of them's an elite. With like some kind of weird bubble move. Perfect parried, you're fucking done. Then why do you have the tag massive coward? What the? No, I don't. My armor mastery? Immense. My armor? Damaged beyond repair, almost. We're getting close now, chat, to the bottom of this cave. You know what that means? Doubters! You know what that means, doubters! Gonna buy a new wizard oil. And fill up with the last one by using that orb. Oh, hang on, there's another one. Oh, shit. There we go. Oh, doubters. Delimbed enemies may go berserk. Berserking enemies cannot be stunned and ignore delim effects. If I were to take this, I would certainly die. There's the exit. All I have to do is make it there alive. 
Allow me to refresh myself. Bash, kick, stab, swing does my spin move. Good. My god! My god! No! Bash, kick! We just keep spamming it when they spot it! It's a tiny room, I've got them! I just have to never let them spawn and attack me! It, it was as easy as that. Holy shit. A lot of people just lost a lot of points if I make it through that portal. All I have to do is not get hit by one of these wall traps and I win. Hmm. The speed's really good. But this spear goes out. Damn, that spear swings fast. Uh, no, I prefer this one. You can pay it out now, mods. Thank you. They lost. The doubters lost. They. You gain brief invincibility when you're dealt a killing blow. That's insane. I'm taking it. Bloody gauntlets, power attacks with your fists, trigger a blood orb spell. It's cool that unarmed builds are a thing, technically, though I don't want it. All right. Yes. The forest has been unlocked. What's up, Helena? Am I still a level one to you? What's max level? Eight with her. Why won't you talk to me? Oh. 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 I just want to see how much. <laughs> what's up? Yeah, what's good, dude? Hey, let me switch my other weapon. Boom, 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 boom. How you feeling? Boom, boom, boom. Damn, man. Bah. All right, see ya. Where's that? Where's that thing that lets me pay an obscene amount of money to become more powerful? First of all. Uh, craft three powerful items. You can only choose one. My weapon's already pretty good. Uh, I mean, that is uh, a really hefty upgrade, that one, actually, still. I'm going to take it. And this is glowing now. This is Sinful Offering. Plus, five, plus a bunch of stats for $16,000. I'll do it once. is what I would say if I wasn't going to do it twice to the forest. This may be the most cursed zone of the entire game. And I'm not going to go any further until I know the predictions are done because I don't want people to know what's up. You're not going to get it for free, fools. Dude, I can't believe I'm playing the default character still. Like, there, There's like so many classes in this game, apparently. And like starter, like loadouts and shit that like totally change how the entire game works. And I'm still on default baby idiot. Let's roll. Oh, Jesus. Yeah, this dude's blocking me. Okay, that guy was fucked. I did not like that. What the hell's going on in this place? They're bad. It's bad. The forest is bad. Oh. More armor mastery. Oh! 
Jesus Christ! What's happening? Why is it so bad in this place? Ow! Dude, I barely made it into the zone. Sell it. Chad, I don't... Guys, I don't feel so good anymore. Ow! Ah! Killed by unknown horror. Well, I got to level four, I guess. I unlocked a new pallet. So I unlocked two new classes. I can play mage, which gives me the ability to stop time. And I have like extra durability with my stabs and spells use less durability. And paladin gives me the ability to bash people with a body slam. I get some armor mastery and some resilience. And I also, use, I could use the holy spirit. Successful blocks trigger a magic shield spell that pierces through enemies. Uh, I'd be down to fucking play either of these. Uh, kind of like the idea of being a paladin. But I also like the idea of stopping time as a wizard. Hmm, only shield weapons and only stabs. Let's do wizard first. Because I can only use stabs or only shields. I did quite a lot of shield weapon that time. We are not so different, you and I. The more you push, the more I push back. A seemingly endless struggle ensues, two indomitable wills. Join me in this rhapsody of violence, and you will find that we are one. Damn, dude, this staff looking silly. What's up with this thing? What's its move? Spectral Mace. Slams enemies from a great distance. What's up, Helena? I still think I'm a... Wait. Fourteen, sixteen gold. Are you telling me this shit actually does carry over across lives? And I spent every single cent I had on, like, microscopic upgrades that didn't ever matter? There's no th way in a million years I'm at 10,003 L's. There's no fucking way. No, the stats don't carry over at all. No, 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 no. Maybe my freeze time move is really cool, though. Freeze! Is that the sound my weapon makes when I hit things? I feel- it sounds like I'm... Like, punching, like, a wet paper towel. I'm that dinky, huh? Okay, the, hang on. What's the range on this? Whoa, hold up. Okay, that's actually pretty cool, though. I've got some huge reach on the charge. So can I now choose whichever place I want to go first? Because I kind of... Looks like the forest is open. I'm going to go to the forest first, dude. That place sucked. I'd rather get it out of the way. That feels fair to me. Let's do the forest first. Also, what's this palette I just got? Orange skies. What color does that make? Okay, orange skies, blue hands, and enemies are light blue as well. I think I still prefer this one. I think I prefer the, the classic. Alright, into the forest. Again. This time, hopefully with better results. All right, I already found the exit and got myself a cool hellfire of haste wand that blasts all nearby enemies with great fire. Okay. 
I really like that for me. Okay, I've got a cool explosive wand. Jesus fucking Christ, I didn't do that. That was the weird, like, twig on the wall. Mm. So far, I'm hesitant to say I like, I like staves. They feel kind of pathetic to me. I'm gonna have to see how I feel after I charge slam someone with, okay, hang on, I'm starting to come around to it. Give me a minute here. Okay, I'm coming around to it. I'm coming around to the to, to stabs. I think I'm coming around to stabs now. I think I echoing hellfire projectiles blast all. Hang on. Whoa, 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 whoa. That does two blasts now. I'm coming around to it. What's up, idiot? Why did my guy not do the blast? What is this idiot doing? He's killing himself. He killed himself. Oh no. Okay. Hang on, I'm coming around to it. When I hit with the bomb move, I instantly kill all enemies in the area in an immense blast. Gloves, I need those. Sell that, sell that, sell that. I have to make up a lot of money, Chad. I spent all of my funds on upgrades that would never carry over to the next run. Wait, what? Instantly cast your spells at no cost when you parry. Okay, so that's how I make- this is the one that I make the, uh, cross with. I unlocked the hammer! Spells deal 110% more damage. Yeah, we're gonna be taking that. I don't see why I wouldn't take that as a wizard class. Staff. Time to fucking use my cool cross move. And spawn some goddamn crosses. I think these stack. Which means, yeah, I just kind of melt people now when I go near them, which is cool. Very good! It's ha None of it's really blowing my mind yet, though, with the wizard class. I think I'd be having more- hang on. Is this, like, the fastest way for me to make these things? Yeah, if I dash and then I attack, it does a cast. So that's a way faster way- Eye of the Storm, Whirlwind Kick Attack. Power thrust that freezes enemies. Hang on. So hang on, hang on, whoa, 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 This is the whirlwind, technically. It's kind of hard with this. Uh, bash, kick, stab, stab. And then whirlwind, kick, attack. That would be the ice move. I could technically do both back to back. Bosses are infused with elite enemy powers and have increased health. I'm not scared of anything. See, I blow up everything I touch. I'm not scared of anything. Oh shit, ow! Wait. Okay, I, I am gonna actually, like, uh, add to that again. I'm really not. Uh, I haven't even used my freeze time move yet. Uh, what chance do any of these creatures have? I just need clothes. I don't own clothes. If someone could help me find clothes, that would be good. All I get is stabs. I haven't seen a pair of clothes all day. I'm gonna go inside that spooky portal, but only once I've found myself some clothes. Uh, I don't even know what I just picked up. I didn't read it. Slow enemies down and makes their blood burst. Okay, hang on. I need to see an enemy to test that. I think I just made that dude explode. Are you kidding me? That's a pretty strong uh, staff. I just make them blow up. I'm barely even doing anything on this character. I just slap my staff on the ground and they turn into goo. Huh. Ow! Dude, I still don't own clothes. I'm fucked. We have to go inside the portal. It's the only way. The portal will hold gear for us. If we survive. Kick propels you upwards. Oh God. Okay, there. Uh, there's parkour in this game. Ow.
Guys, I don't want to play the wizard anymore. Guys, I don't want to play the wizard. I'm going to play the paladin. Doubters keep winning. You won two times. And now, oh my god, look at the size of this thing. So that lasts a long time, the shield move. Okay. Well, the forest sucks, so we're not doing the forest anymore. I'm going down here into the cave. The cave was easy. I'm going to go to the bathroom, and then I'm going to do the cave. I'll be right back. Oh my god, there's actually a lot of people believing. How is that possible? That's... I don't believe it. Oh. I don't know why I expected... I always expect that guy to attack me. And then he doesn't. Okay, let me get a good look at this uh, paladin swing that I have. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Damn, look at these fucking stabbing claws. I know there's a monk class in this game. That's gotta be kind of fun. Maybe I main monk. Maybe that'll be my main. All these weapons are cool, but you know it'd be a lot cooler is just... Hang on. Holy shit. Okay, the shield is good. Uh, my ability is really strong. Seems like I just blow people up if I do it. I don't- I'm not scared of whatever that is. And I never will be. Let's get the hell out of here. Floor one, done. Wish I was a little bit quicker on my feet on this character, but I'm sure that time will come. Attack me! Fool! Okay, that kills everyone in an area when I use it. That's very strong. Okay, I'm gonna totally start forgetting my combos, by the way. There's not a single chance I don't. Ditch those. Put on the helmet. There, now we have a full kit. I'm already starting, like, bash, kick, stab. Okay, that does that one. Dude. Uh, what even was like some of the other ones I got? Hang on. Progress. Uh, whirling dervish bash kick attack attack is my whirlwind. Yep, we know that one. Uh, where is the one that, uh, ex where is it? Whirlwind kick attack. I'm never gonna remember to do this one right. Whirlwind kick attack. I'm guessing it's that one. Ooh. A new scepter. Sorry, I accidentally used my ability. How's my- OW! I was just trying to reach the guy. Alright. Pathetic! The parry in this game just feels really good, chat. It just, the whole, honestly, all the combat in this game just feels fucking crunchy as all hell, and I love it. 
I absolutely love the combat. Instantly kills all regular enemies that attack you. Wait, what? Consumes high durability. Okay. I mean, it's gonna break the armor really quick, but until it does, that's really strong. I unlocked a new staff. Parries grant a speed boost and vulnerability for one, uh, 1.25 seconds. Critical str I guess I take the parry, considering I'm a shield build. Oh, kicks deal 120% damage. Mother of God. Mother of God. Look at the immense power of this paladin. Behold! And yet people doubt, and yet they doubt, but why, when they know the truth? I will slay this dungeon. I will win the video game with my paladin main. I will make a billion dollars and take a million upgrades when I get back onto the surface and be super rich and successful. Heavy metal bash kick attack. Thought that was the one I already. Is that a new one? Okay, so now. Wait, wait, wait. That just upgraded my whirlwind combo. Because now I get a charge attack on top of the whirlwind. You can tell. My god. Oh my god. And it also goes into that one. The, uh. The follow up that I used to think was, like, already pretty strong. Yeah. If I just keep on repeating bash, kick... Okay. Yeah, no, that's awesome. Alright. Watch this. The limbed enemies may go berserk. I don't care. Let them. I don't do a lot of damage. I don't do a lot of damage yet, Chad. I gotta really wait for people to spawn in so I can get some, like, big AoEs going. The ice move works, though. I do one shot with the jab as well, which is really good. Yeah, that part's crazy. I have to repair my weapon. Ow! Yeah, I don't have any defense against that specifically, though. Hit me. Good. All right. Ah. Okay. Uh, I mean, like for having berserk power, they weren't very strong. I don't think that 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 modifier is very difficult for me. Uh, I need to start caring about my stats. I think. Um, I think I need to start reading more. Woo! Hey, hey, woo! Yeah. We're gonna take the sword. Easy! What did you think was gonna fucking happen? That dude has no idea I have the perfectionist skill. And when I parry, I immediately slay whomever dared attack me. Die! Pathetic. This word. This word. Whoa, you wow. Pulls enemy towards you with whirlwind. What? You're telling me now every time I parry, I'm also going to suck them all into the parry? Spin. Whirlwind build, dude. If I just don't die by falling to my death right now in this challenge section that I for some reason can't help myself from doing. 
I'm gonna take the defense. Okay, here we go. That's huge. This one's big. That one's really big. Uh, nah. And you, um, I really like Vortex. I'm not gonna ditch that one. Ha! But they just gave me one that's just slightly worse. Okay. No. No. Or. Yeah, no. Yes. Yes. Easy now. Don't want to fall to my death or something. Is that what I think it is? 6,000 gold to get rid of one of my challenge debuffs, which would be that berserk one. Yep. Take it. Oh my god, I'm I'm seriously, seriously owning right now, Chad. I'm really powerful. And now I just unlock the potion shop. I think I just keep boosting, uh... Oh my god, or I could... I think I keep boosting my perfectionist. For more invulnerability while I'm whirlwinding. Holy crap. Holy shit, dude. I don't know what that move is. That move is just silly. Okay. Ow! The music's great. Dude, honestly... I fucking love this game. I think this game fucking slaps hard. I think this game slaps really goddamn hard. So far. This game rules. Now the question is... Do I want to leave yet? To the next level. I feel like I missed something. Nope, just this vase. Let's get out of here. Another orb. Traps deal decreased damage, but plus one item level and durability restored from wizard or that's worth it for me. It, traps will kill me, but it's worth it. Oh, Jesus Christ. Harry! What did you think was going to happen? Insane gamer. Insane gamer. Insane gamer. The doubters need to understand. You have to. Uh, sell it. Sell it. This one's technically... I think the one I have is better still. Because of the defense. Although this... this... Oh, the doubters just lost. It's over. <laughs> Sorry, doubters, but uh, you just lost the level. Whoopsie daisy. Better luck next time. Uh, swap it. Uh, the thorns is really good. Plus, I haven't had it break yet at all. But eventually, I'm just going to get one shot. I think I have to swap it out. Because it's not like the gear level for it's really bad now. Whoa! Yeah, we're taking that helmet. Trial of Resolve unlocked. You have proven your worth. You may attempt the Trial of Resolve. Over there? I mean, we might need to do a separate prediction to see if I survive the Trial of Resolve. Um... Yeah, I think we, uh, I think we need to do the trial. An optional challenge with powerful rewards. Return here after you complete an area. Yeah, I'm gonna do it. I have a lot of resolve. I'm like one of the most, I have some of the most resolve of anyone I know. Talk to me! Whatever. 
Holy crap. These are some good weapons I get spawning over here. I'm gonna take this. Yep. Maidenless. Shut up! Shut the fuck up! Stop! Dude! The trial! Oh, fuck. God. Just remember my combos. Bash, kick, left click, left click. Kick, left click. Oh shit. Bash, kick, block it! Parry! My shield does so much fucking damage to everyone, dude. Holy crap. Ah! One more kill. Die, freaks. I'm gonna need all of you to fucking die. I just gotta do the spin. Jesus Christ, this place is fucked. Okay, attack me. Attack me. Oh, I lost my window. Where are you? Oh. I won! It's as simple as that, dude. I really overestimated this challenge. Uh... Well, no, I think I just have an insane build right now with uh, some really strong stuff. I think I'm just gaming right now. I don't think my other character would have won that. But right now this guy has insane invulnerability on his parries. Which just makes me really strong. I'm gonna keep boosting it. I have two seconds of invulnerability when I parry now. I just got a good kit. The forest, or the dungeon. The forest sucks eggs. I kind of feel like I want to do it bef like first, so I don't have to deal with it later. Uh. Yes. I think I'm gonna do the forest. The cursed zone. Just get through it. I don't trust this place. It's full of nothing but evil. Ooh! A perk on the wall. What do you think was gonna fucking happen? No, I'm just not gonna let that guy do stuff. I think he's like a necromancer type. Swing at me! Fucking hell! What the fuck was that about? Very good. Oh. I actually didn't realize that this stuff- Wait. Wait! Wait! Just more damage? Oh, we're so in. Alright. Yup. Just a more damaging version of the one I already have. Let's roll. Take a swig of my repair juice. Which I'm actually starting to run a little low on. Uh, I should probably be more careful with how much I spend. Jesus. Fucking hell. Iced. 
I'm getting used to all the combos, dude. I've got them, like, memorized. I'm feeling pretty good about that. What the? A hundred damage on the swing. With this one. And I could boost it. I could make it last a lot longer if I swapped it to the... Eh, no. My kit's feeling pretty... You dare? You fucking dare? That was supposed to be a wave of enemies. Ah well. What can you do? I know there's a harder mode, like, difficulty than this once you beat the game once. I saw it when I was, like, picking my character. It's called Torment Mode. Hoping I can, uh, <laughs> get something that's actually worth a challenge to me that I can actually pay attention to. Because obviously I've become too powerful for this difficulty. <laughs> He's got plot armor. Perhaps. Uh. I actually prefer the swords. Prefer the sword for the hot streak <coughs> ability. One thousand, uh, ten thousand max essence retention between runs. What was my max before? How much am I allowed to retain? And I didn't know that I even had a number that I retained. Whatever. Boost my perfectionist even more. I want to be invincible forever if I parry. I deserve that. <laughs> yeah, what's good? Oh shit. I gotta do this seriously. Cool it. Hang on. I'm gonna back up because that dude's actually really strong. Don't get cocky. I'm not getting cocky. I'm just playing a little silly. I'm being careful. If I wasn't being careful, you'd be able to tell. But why would I, uh, you know, I can at least be a little bit cocky because, I mean, look at me. I mean, look at how I've been dispatching these fools. Look at the strength of these swings. The speed at which I'm dispatching these creatures of the night. Yeah, that's not gonna fucking get me, and neither is that one. How about you do a better swing than that? Boom, parried, goodbye. Pathetic. Do you see what I mean? And now I upgrade my wave blade yet again to a hundred extra damage. Successful blocks freeze the attacker? You have got to be kidding me. Yeah, we're swapping out Vortex for that. That's insane. That is insane. I get almost three seconds of invulnerability when I parry now. Three seconds. I'm actually gonna pay money to uh, have some more potions or one more. Oh boy. See, if I was smart, I wouldn't go in here because there's no reason to put myself in that much danger and run out of my run by accidentally falling into a hole or dying to, like, a trap. But here I am. Oh my god. Oh my god. My fucking god! Dude! This was a big mistake! I lived. All right. Three seconds of perfectionist and an anvil. Ain't no way. Ain't no fucking way. I mean, instantly kills- the thorns one's crazy though. But that's only if they damage me. None of them have been. So I'm actually gonna get rid of it because I've not been getting damaged. Really. Let's roll. God hand unlocked. Fist only combo. Bash attack, kick attack. Hang on. Bash, attack, kick, attack. It's gotta be that one, but only if I was, like... 
I guess, making contact. Scares will fire projectiles at you. Who cares? Uh, minus 24% melee durability loss is insane. Yeah. All of that matters. Where are they? Where's the creatures? Barely even need to frickin' fight, you fools. Dude, I don't even have to parry so far. None of these guys have come near me to attack me. Pathetic. Pathetic! Yeah, we got this. The forest isn't gonna be what pushes us back. It'll be the dungeon. My ex my case in point is that that dude actually thought he was gonna become an elite for a second and attack me. He even got the glow and everything. The fuck out of here. I better not see any doubters next dungeon. I better not see even one of them. Do you understand? You better be believing out of freaking respect. That's all I'm saying, man. The fuck out of here with that elite bullshit. I've seen random ads do more damage. I believe in your dying. Oh yeah, are you so sure after my freaking parry speed boost and invulnerability lasts for 3.25 seconds? Are you fucking sure? You want to keep on pushing me? When I'm invulnerable for an entire dungeon? Ah, oh, what the fuck was that shit? My swings come out so Easy. Easy, guys. Chill. Chill. Chill, guys. Relax. We can all be friends, dude. It's fine. Fucking mowing the lawn. Mowing the lawn. What is that attack, dude? I just don't know what it is. Oh, that's good. Yeah, we take that. Uh, recover a small amount of... I'm gonna swap that. And yeah, we're gonna grab this sword. Can use this when I'm not fighting anything urgent because it'll give me extra... Ooh. Swap it. Are my boots still suck? I kind of need better. Mother of God, 3.5 seconds of invulnerability. 3.5 seconds. Time to get out of here. Ow! The only thing that'll kill me is traps on the ground. We know this. Fool. What a sad fool. Never punished? Why would I be punished? Quick step. Uh, increases dash distance. That's pretty good. Item skill. Have I reached the maximum level of... Oh god, I totally have. I could boost my melee damage, or I could just boost my speed. Hmm. It's a percentage. So I think melee damage is better because I don't have that much speed to boost the percentage of. Anyways. Holy shit, dude. Come on. Chat! We are watching the same thing, right? Did you not see? I just mowed down half the dungeon. This is chop goblins all over again. Hang on, I just have to... Cool. New perk, and let's get out of here. A 
pathetic. Yeah, that's the only scary thing is those uh, nightmare things. That guy also summons them, which I didn't remember. Wow, that's a lot of damage on that. Uh, but it's not better than what I have. Okay, let me just make sure I've got all- I think I'm on the last level of this dungeon. Or this zone, yeah. Man, I've got a lot of money, too. I just wish I knew what the maximum amount I was allowed to carry is. Holy heck. Uh, extra luck. I don't really need the speed, actually. Kinda want HP. Alright. This next zone might be hard. I don't have a lot of HP, chat. This could be the moment the doubters were waiting for. Pressing every floor. Oh yeah, who cares about that? Give me extra. Give me extra item levels. Yeah, I don't care if more enemies respawn. Ah! Ooh! Ooh! You think you can just? Yeah! He can be hurt, so can they. So can they. Look at the damage of this fucking mace. Holy crap, that's a fucking volatile one. Yup, we take those. Uh, brutality helmet, sell it. Gloves of brutality, take them. HP hat with an extra top, like, oh my god, that's actually a really good helmet for a green. Uh, this one's take half of all damage. Yep, uh, we're gonna just take that. I could split it again. Okay. And... Enemies hit by traps will explode on impact. That's not bad. But I think I prefer just having extra defense and luck right now. Oh, yes. Mana shield user smedge. We're doing the trial again. We're there. We have a mandatory requirement to do the trial every single post level. None of those are worth it. I'm gonna buy some new health potions. I'm not a fool. And then I will spend one boost of sinful offering. Get those gambers in. We're about to make a lot of money. Dude, how much is this fucking game again? Hang on, I need to like actually check this because this game feels like... $20. I remembered I thought it was a little bit on the higher side for like an indie roguelike game. Feels like a very well spent 20 now. <laughs> it's time. The trial. Again. Bash, kick, stab. It seems bloodier than I remember. Oh, you can't just let me get the fucking parry, doofus. You can't just let me get the parry, doofus. Bash, kick, stab, sweep. You're pathetic. You can't just let me get the parry twice in a row. You know I'm invincible when I do the parry, right? You can't just let me do it twice. You're nothing to me! Get the fuck out of my way! 
Go ahead, summon someone to help you. Go ahead. You. I'm gonna enjoy this as soon as I'm done enjoying this drink. Like mowing the fucking lawn. All right. Jesus. All that's left is that one idiot who doesn't even know if he's alive or dead. He's just kicking at where he thinks there's a guy. What was the name of my my palm exploding palm attack? Bash, attack, kick, attack. Bash, attack, kick. Okay, I exploding palmed him. Double strike, bash, attack, attack. Okay. Okay, what does that do for me? Combo cancels recovery of your last attack. Okay. So all of these purple ones, all these glowing ones are all perks. Holy crap, I'm absolutely cracked, dude. Benefit from two weapon perks at the same time? How the fuck does that work? Are you telling me I have both of these now at the same time? Wait. Oh my god. It's over. Doubters. I don't want to see anyone doubting on the next one. I don't want to see it. Going into the base game dungeon, I just don't want to see it. Why won't you talk to me? I'm basically God. Why won't you talk to me? Why won't you talk to me? Why don't you like me? I, I literally slayed like a thousand creatures in the arena. Why am I maidenless to this extent? I don't understand. It just doesn't make any sense. Eh, it's not worth it. I am going to boost my stats this time. I feel like this is the kind of run that I try to make it all the way to the end on. Need as much power as possible. $687 to my name. Jesus Christ. It's time. Into the dungeon. Foolish. Futile and foolish. Holy crap, that's a lot of damage on that. It's a morning star though, we don't want it. Oh, let's have protection. I have to be really careful of traps because that's what's gonna be what kills me. Uh, worse. Hello? Pathetic. Elite! It's so sad that I was able to parry you, dude. You looked like you were so strong. Maybe next time. Maybe next time. I wonder if you can parry traps. I can parry, like, projectiles from, like, wall traps and stuff. My mastery of weapons grows. Yeah, I don't imagine um, the mage build would have worked out as well as this paladin has. This guy's, um... He thought. He fucking thought. Do I take the thorns at this point? 
Nah. It's worse than both of them. Where are these guys coming from? I'm not gonna complain, they keep giving me perks. But where are they coming from? Did Tomato get good? I've been pretty good at parrying from the start on this one, actually. Oh, the respawning enemies. That's actually so good for me. Wait, that's actually like a good, a, like, curse to always have. Hang on. Stuff's kind of damaged, so I'm just gonna use the orbs. Excuse me. Just gonna parry again off of that. These, these wizard guys are, like, seriously, I don't think have clocked that they are a free parry for me every time I see them. Dude, I can't not get a free parry off of them. Holy crap. Every time I see one of them, I start frothing at the mouth. Even more damage. Did that guy just try to block? Dude, are you scared of me? Ow. Stop. I'll be back for you. Okay, that's all of them. I've sinned too hard. I've become too strong. Where's the one that I that I knocked the whole? Hang on. Generate health a few seconds after taking damage. Uh, ah, bad. Bad. I gotta be mindful of when I'm not picking up orbs to drink a potion, so I'm always like, I always have space. Cause I should be using, I should always have uh, my shit full if there's potions out. Whoa! You can parry uh, scare projectiles. Uh, I just tested that. Okay, that's cracked. Wait, I kinda wanna see if I can parry a fucking trap now. You cannot. You cannot parry traps. Makes sense. Glad I didn't do that much damage to me, so it's fine. Uh, I really like the two perks I have now that I know that I, like, share them. So, uh, I'm gonna hang on to what I have right now. What? I'll be seeing you later, Axe Spell. And I'll be taking instantly decapitate kill every enemy with a fucking left click. What was that? Lightfoot? Kick steal. So I dash now when I kick as well and kick steal extra damage. Don't need it. Holy shit. Holy shit. That's crazy. Was that an elite? No, that was just some guy, but I just left clicked his head twice and he died. All right, let's go. Get the fuck out of my way. Get the fuck out of my way. Get out of my way. Hang on. Boom. Die, freak. Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ. I gotta backtrack and pick up all the loot I just made. Excuse me. Excuse me. Where does it start? There it is. Extra damage on that first. I think I got- okay. Like a lawnmower, dude. Jesus Christ. Ready for torment difficulty. Definitely. Trash. Trash and we hate it. What? Guillotine of protection. Are those... Are those, um... Boots with an axe blade on them? Ha! Monk build, dude. Monk build. 
All right, let's roll. Focus, strike, and luck. Thrusting attacks deal more damage. Okay, that's even better. Oh, hang on. Okay. Hit 20 attacks total to make a powerful explosion. Uh, I'm gonna take that. Hi. Oh. I got it anyways. Jesus Christ. I have like no words for how strong I feel on this character. This is like the this might be the biggest power trip I felt in a fucking roguelike in a long time. Mainly because of how involved the combat is in this game at the start, especially. That like suddenly being immensely powerful at this level is crazy, dude. Holy shit. Dismemberment has a 10% chance to also dismember one or more enemies nearby. All right. That was like the worst thing that could have happened though. That was bad. My durability, dude. Mother of God. All right. Well, that's all of them respawned. I kind of want to do the portal before I leave. Did I just blow that guy up from across the map with my block? Okay, well, I'm here, so I might as well clear these two at least. Or three, or five. Or I might as well clear the whole group now, so let's just get it over with. Okay. Sell it. All right. Get rid of it. I thought you were playing a dungeon crawler, not a Beyblade simulator. It didn't used to be like this. And then it became like... Holy shit, that's a lot of damage on that scepter. It's just too bad it doesn't have a spell, because that's all I care about. Oh. Yeah, what's the catch, though? Okay. It was just a freebie. It's got a bunch of loot. Immune to scares. Nah. Scares aren't that dangerous. Trash. Ah, uh, trash. Ah, uh, trash. Uh, okay, roundhouse kick. Let me see this. I kind of like it. Trash. All right, let's roll. Full moon unlocked. Kick bash attack, bash kick bash attack. Impossible for me to ever remember this. Oh, I did it. Kick bash attack, bash kick bash attack. I, I just fucked it up. Kick bash attack, bash kick bash attack. Wait. Kick bash attack, bash kick bash attack. It's... Never gonna come up. Dude, it's never gonna come up in a million fucking years. It's never coming up. Kick, bash, attack, bash, kick, bash, attack. Or is it? Kick, bash, attack, bash, kick, bash, attack. I got it. I got it. I just did it. Enemies may release a scare on death. I, uh, I don't want to do that because I think I don't get invulnerability on that shit. Yeah, I already have something that boosts scare damage, makes them shoot projectiles, and I don't get invincibility when I get out of a scare. So that'd be me actually killing myself. I'm afraid that one isn't going to be possible. 
Kick, bash, attack, bash, kick, bash, attack. It's just not very good, is the thing. Compared to me just like fishing for a parry. Ow. Ouch. My HP! Ah! What just happened? I couldn't see my HP! I thought I was at full! It just glowed for a second! Ah! Yo, we just unlocked the monk though, dude. Holy. Dude! Monk, dude! Should have just kick bash, kick attack, kick bashed, and then kicked. In a fit of rage, you twist the threads of fate. The will burns bright, but no flame can burn forever. The time has come now for your flame to be extinguished. Oh yeah? Roundhouse kick by default. Fists of steel, your punch deals more damage. Unarmed block prevents all damage. And I have the dragon punch. An invincible uppercut that deals bonus damage and causes a fiery explosion. Please talk to me. Why will this girl not talk to me? I feel like she should be. Not <laughs> into you, bro. No, I mean like this is like she's supposed to give me like quests. Like challenges that give me bonuses during the fight. Like if I do like certain challenges during like a le like a floor, she's supposed to give me things. And she's not. Like what the fuck is up with that? I'm just Okay, there's that dragon fist. Hang on, let me try that again. It's Attack, bash, attack, bash, attack, kick, bash. What is it? I totally forgot. There's like one move that I absolutely want to be using. God hand, bash, attack, kick, attack. Bash, attack, kick, attack. Bash. Bash, attack, kick, attack. That's the that's the one. Okay. We're going into the dungeon. I'm gonna be fast. I'm gonna be so fucking fast, chat. I've been brought back down to earth. It's not the same. At least I'm rich. At least I didn't lose any of my money. There's some things that never change. Like I'm still really good at parrying. Again. Tomatoes beating on defenseless people. That is fundamentally wrong and you know it. These dudes are not defenseless. They beat the shit out of me. Wish I had a way to reach the fucking floor. These boxes are on the ground. In a way that I can barely reach. Okay. Uppercut! Okay, that guy died instantly. That's good to know. The roundhouse is fun. You know, this monk might not be too bad. I don't have to care about weapons anymore. The only thing I care about is gloves and armor. This could be pretty good. So far, it doesn't feel very strong compared to the paladin, but I mean, there's a lot of time for that to change. Hold up. We just got funny shoes. Things might finally be looking up for us. We better get a move on. Get out of here. If I knew where the exit was, where's it? There it is. Let's get the hell out of here. I take every debuff orb I see, by the way. We take every single bonus in the game. What's this? Boost my damage. I want to hit hard. Just kick that dude's fucking head off. Kick into the trap and die. Fucking hate
hate that guy. Oh. Free money, dude. The game feels bad for me after how I was owned last time, tragically. The game feels bad. Whoa. So I still get my whirlwind moves and stuff. So I'm not, it's not like my old combos don't still matter. Th that said, that crazy combo is never being used because it's trash. I don't know why I would want to use that over just doing the one that's really fast setup. Pity portal. It's not pity. The game just knows I deserve it after how much hard work I put in last time. There's a difference. There's a difference. Thank you for remembering that next time you say something stupid. Complete the level without- there we go! Why wasn't I getting- complete the level without using any potions and I gain an innate skill. Okay, cool. I'm not gonna use a potion. We take that. I don't need a potion for this. Okay, I'm already wounded. Chad, I don't feel so good! Chad, I don't feel so good! Monks don't feel good to me, chat! Wait. It might be okay if I can just avoid getting hit by the weird head. Dynamite strike! Just you and me, freak. Okay. I lived. We lived. Just don't use any potions for a hot second. We're not done with this place yet. I still have to leave the entire zone. Jesus, imagine punching someone so hard their limbs fly off, but their torso remains totally perfect. Interesting. Good. Stop blocking. Jesus. Oh shit. No, no, no word. I'm not that strong. I miss being a paladin, dude. I used to do so much fucking damage. Now look at me. I'm pathetic. I'm weak. I'm feeble. Barely even know how to do the dragon punch. Barely know how to do anything at all. Times have changed. I just need more money. That's what it is. This would all be better if I just had more money. There. I did it. Fucking hell. We're gonna make it out of here. I'm not Lol Monk. It's not Lol Monk yet. You'll see. I just need to do more damage. You'll fucking see. Ow! I barely even- Ow! Ow! Fuck! They're all way stronger than me! This is a- oh, How was supposed to be? I used to be a god! Give me this shit! I will! Win! I just need time. You'll all see! Ow! Even normal wizards punch my head off! I just need gloves with, like, blades on them. Remember, that was a thing. I saw one of those. That was real. Death is coming. No, it isn't. Scares will slow your movement and attack speed. Scares no longer grant invincibility. Kick damage plus 14. We take that. I need damage on my kicks. You! What is that? Oh, that's like a fucking super blast. Oh! I am not defeated that easily, man. The roundhouse kick. Boom! I kicked your head off. 
Boom, I kick your freaking arm off, dude. And I do it a hundred more times. Boom. Where's the last one? I gave that guy the dynamite uppercut. Holy shit. Holy shit. We finally got a monk item, dude. Holy crap. I kick fireballs now. Doubters? Wait, 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 wait. No, I like this one more. Boost the thorns. Sell those. Take that. Sell that. Is that the guillotine? No, 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 no. We stay focused. The fireball's better. We made it out. Next up is the fucking trial. I'm not gonna live through the trial. Oh, 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 look, she has something to say to me. For some, hidden talents can be awakened. Which skill would you like to learn, monk? Wait. Are you saying I can just simply say from now on forever, if I punch someone's head off, they instantly die? No strings attached? I now have Headhunter forever on this character. I'm gonna do some fishing for some better gloves. Those ones. And one more. One more. One more. I'm down to fish for like good moves. Bash and punch? Wait, really? Bash and punch damage is increased by half your defense. That's good for me, guy with a bunch of defense who also bashes and punches. Yeah, I'm spending most of my money on this right now. Trying to get like a good glove. No, one more. All right, we're done. We're done. We're done. We're done. No more. No more. No more. I'm going to spend the rest of my money boosting my health, getting some HP potions for the trial. It's time. We can handle this. It's just the trial of death. And I'm far more powerful than I was moments ago. I shoot fireballs out of my feet. If I kick someone's head off, do they just die? Who knows? I wonder if they just die. Chad, I take a lot more damage without invulnerability! Ow! Oh. Oh. I don't feel so good. Whatever buff is in here, I need it now! I don't just punch people's heads off fast enough. This is bad. I have to get a parry or something. Or I just keep kicking fireballs into the crowd. Wait, this might work. Back off! Oh my god. Oh my. Ow! Once they break all my clothes, I'm fucked. Ow! Oh. Fuck away from me, that's it! I have to get a parry. I can't hit someone with a parry! Oh my god. My potions! Whoever this dude is, he's the most strong warrior here. My clothes! How could this happen to me? How am I mostly... They've peeled off most of my clothes. I hate Monk. 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 And I hate this guy. Ow! My clothes! He ripped my shoes off! My fire shoes! 
Now my shoes don't do anything. Ow! Oh, my clothes are gone. Oh, my clothes are gone. Who are you? Who are you? He doesn't have anything. I delimbed him. Ah, he's got like a fucking slow aura too. Ah! Give me this. I might just barely survive through careful positioning if I can just get rid of this freak. Did anyone see the attack that guy did or what happened there? Did anyone see like a weapon up here or something? Cause I thought I saw a weapon spawn in. Rip Bozo. We unlocked a new class. The Berserker. Only big swords, no vital or magic essence spawns. Berserker Rage, invulnerable during Whirlwind. Gain brief invincibility on your next attack. How big is this sword? You live day by day in ignorance, unknowing and uncaring. All the majesty that lies before you is but a distraction of the mind. Like a castle made of sand, your immortality construct is lost to time. Holy shit. Holy shit. How big are we talking here? Jesus Christ. Holy. Okay. That's a big sword. That's a huge sword. We're going in. L for slow. Well, before we judge it based off of how slow it is, let's judge it based off of whether or not I one-shot the first enemy I hit with it. You know? I think that's the better way to do it. Hang on, I'm gonna go like... I'm gonna go do a blacksmith run to see if I can get myself a better version of the weapon before I go in there. Do you like me now? I'm almost level one. Dude, I'm in, dude! Whoa. Better one. Take hot streak. And... Yeah, take that as well. Cool. Starting with clothes. Alright, believers. It's time to start... It's time to start really trying to believe. We may actually have a strong class here. We'll have to see. And do I have any new pellets? Nope. What? That was a default left swing. That wasn't like a power attack. Mother of God. What? Oh my god, it's game over, baby. Holy shit. What is going on? I think the doubters need to start pivoting. Into the po- oh. I think I'm also Im immortal when I'm power swinging with a uh, whirlwind. So I can only really take damage if I'm uh, not whirlwind. Huge. Grab that. I'm going in. Oh, this might just end me either way. Don't worry, chat. No matter how much you believe, I could still die to this part. That's real. Huh. Not today. Give me this. Hop. Block it. Parry it. Hop. Block it. Step aside and jump it. Oh my god. Oh yes. We're good. 
Oh, we're very good right now. We got the perfectionist ability. Whoa. Damn, what's this? Oh my god, we get another one too? Multiple perks on the first level. We're kitted. We're kitted already. Uh, power strike deal 110% more damage. I think we just take the one where we just do flat damage on everything. We just take weapon mastery. Mother of fucking god, the parry on this thing is gonna be the crunchiest thing ever, dude. Holy crap. Oh, this is my class. It's here. Mother of- they're just exploding in the limbs. Jet. It's just limbs. He's starting to believe. I always believed. It's just you. It's just all of you that didn't believe in me. That's what it is. I always believed. What is that? Is that Vortex? It's Vortex. There was never a moment where I wasn't believing in myself. To be clear. That said, I don't get a lot of essence for repairs or healing, so I have to be a little more careful on that. Uh, I'm taking that. The, fa the fact that the fucking spin move, the stab move before the spin attack on that combo can be just hovered over enemies' bodies and technically apply the damage is crazy. Jesus Christ. Barely even need to do Whirlwind. I haven't even used my ability yet. Like, look at the damage. Nothing matters anymore. Not one thing. Oh, heck. Goodbye. Bye bye. Okay, bye. I'm going in. Where am I going? What? Oh. Oh. Simple as that. Now we just do it again. Shut. This is huge for me as a guy who can't replenish his potions. Yeah, welcome to the dungeon, dude. What the fuck did you think was gonna happen? All right, let's roll. Move! Move! Trash. Hand. Goodbye. I think it, with this weapon, I'm genuinely not even looking at their perks. I'm just looking at what says most damage, because I want to one-shot the heavies when I see them. Because I think they're the... Oh, I didn't need to sell that. I actually need a helmet still. Complete the level within 48 seconds. Upgrade one of your passive skills to max level? You're on! Take that. Grab it. Let's go. Move. Move! <laughs> the fact that I can just aim at bodies, dude, is crazy. Okay. Uh, so that. 40 seconds left. Got him. Shell. Alright, let's roll. Wait, what? Oh shit, I gotta go this way. Oh. Mission accomplished. Let's get the hell out of here. The slow-mo gives is crazy too. Yeah, I feel very powerful right now. Uh, enemies can now critically strike. That's not great for me, but two item levels for drops would be crazy, and the speed would be huge for how slow I am. I'm willing to risk it for the speed. Okay. 
Big moment, this one. Bash, kick, stab. Ah! Ah! You will die before me! Move. Yep, now we got it. If we can just boost my speed, dude. Wait, what? I didn't realize the swiftness was still active. Okay, well, uh, I will take an immense upgrade to my weapon then in exchange. You forgot? I thought I finished the level because uh, I went down the stairs. Because usually these things are floor based. Uh, so I didn't realize it was the whole dungeon. Oh well. I'm not gonna lose too much sleep over it. I'm sure I will be just fine. Kinda want Vortex. Wow. Yeah, that's, uh, that'll do. All right, next up is the ordeal. Next up is the ordeal. Uh, huge. Take that. Big damage on that. You want the extra HP. Scares. Yeah, all those are pretty bad. All right, let's go fill up my HP. Okay. To the ordeal. To the ordeal. Yeah, it's always trial after the, uh, the thing. As soon as I'm back up here, it's trial. To the ordeal, the stream is already open, dude. He's so mad at me for being slow. I never said that. I never said that. Ever. But you thought it. No, I didn't. Look at that dude's weird ass mouth. And all the bones. Tell you what, though, it is hard to do the uh, Berserker Whirlwind activation. I just gotta kill this guy fast. Charge it and swing again. Jesus. That guy sucks. I want that elite gone. I gotta get better at my parrying again. It was easier with the bar with the uh, paladin for some reason. That or I just like felt safer trying it. But I really gotta get better at it. There we go. Where the fuck did that guy go? I guess I got him. I'm low HP, but I want to finish the spin. Okay. All right. Perfect. I need to repair. Blocked it. You're pathetic! You're never gonna beat me! And I'm only gonna get more, get stronger as time goes on. <laughs> Yeah. All right. Now compare this to when he was a monk. Yeah, it really is like night and day. So what's eating up? Oh, power strikes and bashes stun all enemies. Yeah, that's gonna be. It's gonna be a bad one eventually. We're gonna have to let this weapon just break. Luck. Actually, might be worth grabbing. Nah, we'll grab that. Let's roll. Uh, 
This might actually be worth just swapping to for the sake of getting some wizard oil for repairs off of it. We'll do the forest next. Mainly because it's my least favorite place. And I fear it the most. Because I don't understand it. But I don't think I should be too scared of it. Because I do cleave them in twain so very easily. Holy shit. Hot Streak is a good one for this weapon. Die, freaks. Streamer's scared of nature. No, I'm scared of being punished by the video game. It's the better version. Okay. Dude, I just gotta pump my speed somehow, dude. I don't know how, but I gotta... Holy heck. Lost 10 damage on that. But then I'd lose my mana battery, which I don't want to lose. We're gonna sell it. How's this game been, uh, like visually though, chat? Cause I had to do quite a lot of stream changes to make it like display well on, t uh, like on Twitch. Looks good. All right. Bad. <laughs> what the fuck? It's a bit disorienting. Well, that's the game. That's not the visuals. That's like the, that's just the speed of the game. Not much I can do about that one. I'm only worried about, like, the fact that it's got, like, forced noise on all the time. Alright. That felt like a perfect parry. I don't know why I didn't get credit. Holy shit. Divine Radiance of Power, the... Hang on. Divine Radiance of Power. A mediocre weapon that's not much better than any of the things I currently own. But it does glow yellow. Which makes it cool. Wait, 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 what? This didn't convey when I picked it up that it automatically does Whirlwind every time because it's permanently charged. No, 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 chat. That's not me. My light attack is now a Whirlwind, which means I'm unkillable. As long as I have durability on this weapon. Doubters aren't feeling so good. Oh, unless that guy kicks me in the face. They can still get me with a kick to the face. I can't see. I think I just sell every other weapon I own now. Yeah, I think I sell everything. Yeah, the only dangerous part for me now is the wind up. It still takes me a while to wind up my attack. All right. Fiery boots. Yeah, speed is all I care about, I think, right now. My attack is insane. Perform five parries. If I do this, I would get an innate skill. I'm willing to die to try. I'm willing to actually take a million damage and fucking die trying. Was that one? No, that wasn't it. Dude, that's not an attack. That one that- there's one that they do that isn't even a real attack. How are these- That was a perfect one. I don't think the projectiles count for it. Okay, there's too many of these dudes now. That was another. There was another. 
away from me. There's too many of them. That one makes more. I might clear these two. And not kill the fucking ghoul. Okay, the projectiles count. I'm gonna get one off of that. Dude, fuck off. I just don't have time for you right now. Okay. Might need to loop back on that in a second. Once I'm done getting rid of this freak, that's gonna totally kill me. Where is he? What the fuck? There's like... Dude, this dude's glitched into the ground! I'm cool. But that guy was in the ground. Where is he? I can do this. It didn't count. That did. Fucking die. It cost me everything. No, 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 his legs weren't off. He was, he was in the ground. He wasn't like, he wasn't in like, well, it doesn't matter. Anymore. We should all forget that ever happened. I got what I needed. I have zero HP, but I lived. And now, I just have to get out of here alive. With nothing. This'll help. It does help. A little. Trash. Trash. Terrible hand. Okay. Just gotta keep my wits about me. Don't want to get jumped. As long as I just keep whirlwinding through all danger, I won't take damage from traps either. It gives me invincibility. We see this. Bad. I think I need the defense. No, I don't. I, I need to stick with what I have right now. Okay. Pressing every floor plate. Who cares about that? Respawn more enemies. Uh, that's honestly enemy am amount isn't going to change very much at this point. Just gotta clear these fucking super ads as they fucking spawn. That's all. Good news is my ultimate ability synergizes really well with my uh, super rare. If I don't die here, I will be fucking rich. Dude, I need the whirlwind to go off. My guy keeps dodging because I'm pressing the wrong button because I'm stupid. Jesus. There's like a million clones. Oh. <gasps> I'm still alive! Ah! I don't actually know what killed me. I wish I could tell you, but I don't. Uh, I don't know if it was a trap, it was poison, it was a little branch. Might have been a little branch. At least I unlocked the color palette Piccolo. Dude, I would have been the most powerful warrior ever. I should have been. No, I have a million dollars. I go again. I'm gonna go fast. I'm gonna fucking do this. I'm not gonna wait for Gambus this time. We're just gonna gun it. Because I got enough time for one more run. This one I'm doing for me. Headhunter. Grab it. This one, I'm doing because I need to prove something. First of all, you die. Second of all, let's go. Hang on, what does Piccolo look like, the color? It really is like Piccolo. The character. I prefer original. Powerful. Everyone just has to have a little bit of faith. 
I just need everyone to have some faith. I will win. I will. I will win. I need people to just collectively believe. For once, I need faith. Can we all just do that? I believe we can. Why don't I just spam that charge attack, the uh, the stab, considering it also one-shots enemies? Why don't I just do that every time? Why don't I just kick into the stab? It's not like I have to do a swing. It's the fastest move I have. Boost my weapon damage. Why have I not been doing this from the start? Hold up. Wait, hold up! Wait! Wait the meta! Wait the meta! I'm in! Let's roll! Get out of my way! Can't you see I've learned a new meta trick? I have a dungeon to beat in the next 15 seconds. Delimbed enemies may explode when they hit you. They're never gonna hit me. They're gonna be completely delimbed long before that. Arise! Creatures, get the fuck back in the ground. Look at that, look. Look, Chad, look at what I'm doing to them. Ow! The stab. The stab! <laughs> Wait, why haven't I been doing this? This is better than the whirlwind. All I have to do is poke them! Oh my god. The poke tech. I don't know why I didn't think of it sooner. It all made sense. I just didn't want to look at it. Parrying poker. I haven't even right clicked all dungeon, dude. Stop. Fuck out of here. Huge. Vortex is cool though. Where is it? Where's the last guy? Oh, there you are. Oh. Ah, uh, very good. Let's, uh, let's get out of here. To the next leg of the dungeon. Huge. Boom. I wasn't even wearing shoes up until now. Poke tech is powerful. It could get us through this entire place. Complete the level without taking any damage. You've got to be fucking kidding me. All right. Fuck, I'm not gonna succeed on this. Just be careful. Nope. Fuck off. I'm gonna be real careful about this. I'm not gonna- you know what I am. Yeah, this isn't- this isn't even a damaging zone. I can do this. Boom. As long as I don't fall to my death, I'll make a million billion dollars off of this. Where am I going next? There's a healing potion there if I want to buy it. Ah! We're gonna take those. Hop! I'm gonna go up here. Hop! Because there's money here for me. And an anvil. To get some really good shoes. And what's that? What do they also do? Invulnerable while dashing. Cool. Whoa. Hop. I'll just go down. Whoa. This place is a total shithole, chat. 
Oh. Cool. Well, all the buttons I need are- Mother of God. Oh my God, they spawned right on me. Fuck off. Okay. We are going to leave this place with zero damage taken. That I can assure you. I'm not even gonna go for that. Boom. Innate skill obtained. After we do the next part. Because it's the dungeon. It's, it's the fucking dungeon. Increased enemy movement and attack speed, minus 24. Okay, I have to do this for the sake of. It, the, the buff I get is insane. Fuck. I have to get rid of this guy, and there's no fucking way. I have to get the whirlwind! Damn it! Yeah, nah, that wasn't gonna happen. Because the wind-up on the whirlwind is the- I, I had to get invulnerable to even survive all those guys. Nah, it was, it was, it was close, though. Okay. I don't know why I drank that, because I think I get a free refill when I leave. Nothing. Uh. All those monk items that would have mattered back when I was a monk. What a shame. What a goddamn shame. Into the trial. Immediately. I get immune to damage like this. Okay, so I need to start using my dash more carefully, my ability. Because that did give me invulnerability for the entire power charge I did there. If I time it right. Like, I'm invulnerable for that entire charge. Sometimes it doesn't activate. Oh, oh. Drink. Swig. I want to try to get a parry. Not against this asshole, though. If I can help it. Cut through the ball! I don't know why sometimes the dodge move that I have on this uh, barbarian doesn't activate. Invulnerability when it's supposed to. Oh. This is this class is actually extremely difficult in comparison to the uh, others I've played, just because of how slow it is and how fast everything else is. Even without the buff I gave them. Yeah, I don't think it's gonna happen. But maybe. I mean, I'm, as long as my weapons don't break, I'm still very strong. Especially with the buffs. I might be okay. I'll be able to replace my clothes if I... Okay. I uh, did not really see the telegraph on the, the, the fucking ranged spooky creature move that just killed me. Uh, wasn't really able to react to that one. Not much I could do on that one, chat. I got got by purple guy. But I mean, hey. Uh, damn cool fucking game. I'll give it that much. Damn cool game, chat. Damn cool game. Still in early access. They actually put a lot of content out for it, like, regularly. It, uh, it gets, like, pretty, pretty chunky updates when, uh, when it gets an update. It doesn't fuck around. Yeah. All right, chat. I'm gonna be starting to wind down and wrap up here because, uh, I have to go get some food. I have to go get myself some food. I'm fucking hungry, man. I gotta eat. I need, a, I need a fucking snack, and I need it now. Apparently there's, uh, I got an alert from my family that there's hogs upstairs.
So I'm going to go get myself a hog or two, I think. I'm going to go ahead and enjoy myself a nice hog. Yep. Don't tell me you call them hogs to your family. If I do, they would support me if I did. And I know that. I know that without a doubt in my mind. That they would support me through that. So I'm not too concerned. All right? And I'll call it however I want to call it. Family of freaks, how fucking dare you? Your name is Sick Weenie Nick. How fucking dare you? How dare you? You better watch what you fucking say, Nick. You can't do that? Oh, I fucking can. My name is socially accepted? I'm not so sure about that. I'm not so sure about that. No, it ain't. No, it ain't. Where, where's your license? Where's your registration that shows that it was accepted by a by a freaking by a, by a committee of your peers? Who fucking says? I don't want to hear it, Quantum Dweeb. What the fuck? But, but I didn't. But I don't understand what I... But I didn't do anything wrong. This is all Nick's fault. I blame Nick. For everything that happened, I blame Nick. I didn't even get a cool... Look at this fucking screenshot chat on the goddamn standby. Why the fuck... I didn't even get a katana. I, not one katana has spawned for me. LMAO, no one cares, idiot. What is that command? Is that a command? It ats me. It ats me? Oh, it ats anyone who does it. Oh, nice, 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 nice. Wait. Oh. You, Katie, you have to unblock that. You, I, I'm, I'm gonna need you to unblock that. I'm going to need you to unblock that. You're going to have to unblock that term. That's not allowed. You can't do that. Katie, you can't do that. No. Hang on. Slash. How, how, how do you? I don't know how to. Hang on. I'm allowed to. Or I'm not. Katie, unblock it now. Nightbot ignored him? I'm gonna have to go into Nightbot's fucking bones. Uh, chat, I'm gonna climb into Nightbot's freaking brain. And I'm gonna fucking lobotomize it. I swear to God, I will. I will rip that thing to goddamn shreds. Whatever it takes to solve this, I will. I will get in there and I will screw it up bad, Chad. You have no idea how crazy I can be. Anyways, chat, uh, I'm going to go get myself some food because I'm freaking hungry and I need some. Uh, I do not know if I'll be streaming tomorrow. If I'm not, uh, I'll be streaming Saturday and Sunday. Uh, Saturday being some kind of hefty thing before D&D &D and Sunday being uh, the earlier stream before Snow Runners. Uh, if I do something tomorrow, it'll probably be... Uh, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna hold off from saying what it'll probably be just in case. Um, but yeah. I got stuff on the on the, on the the docket. So, uh, should be a good time. Should be a good time. Are you ready for the storm on Saturday? What storm? Ban Ban Saturdays. We will be getting through the Ban Ban thing soon. We will do the other two. That is the plan. I will be. The storm. Horrible East Coast weather. Whenever it rains outside, my power goes out, so I can't even imagine what a horrible rain would do to me. Oh, no. Well, I'll be back tomorrow or Saturday. I'll label it in the chat and probably say I'll be back tomorrow and then, uh, 
no matter what freaking switcheroo it at the very end, or right before I go live anyways tomorrow. You all know the deal. I'll see you tomorrow. Wink. I'll see you tomorrow. Wink. Thanks for the gifted subs and donations and bits. Bye.